No. I'm literally so like I'm sitting here right now trying to figure out why when I turn off my my heating my condo gets even hotter I'm sweating fucking tits over here hold on I'm so sorry
Okay, whatever. I don't think I'm gonna find a solution, so we ball. Okay. Ray, shut the fuck up. Shut up. No, you cannot play Destiny with Red because unfortunately... Um... I actually, you know what? I don't have an excuse. I don't have an excuse. I'm just a dictator. Maybe if you didn't take so long to send me my little horseshoe pussy, then we wouldn't be having this problem. I love samosas, me too. How are you, Samosa Poppy? What's up? Okay. Hi, Avalon, hello. I look so good, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, I kinda like, I can feel my face melting now because of how fucking hot my condo has gotten in the last like 20 minutes or 10 minutes rather, but we ball, it's okay. I can't hear anything though. Oh, there we go. Now I can hear stuff. Okay. Woo! I'm so sorry that I'm late. I honestly, I wanted to go live way earlier. I had my whole day prepared and planned out. But unfortunately, depression got the best of me. And so I took a big fat nap. I tried taking selfies. Could barely do that. I took like three. We ball. And then I took a depression nap. And now I have a headache. But! That's okay, because I'm here now, and we're going to play Final Fantasy, because the game has yet to DC, so we're chilling. We're good. It's going to be a good night. We're going to be all right. Hey, Dentist. How are you? Hi, Psychotic. Hello. You have spaghetti, and you're not sharing with the class? What the fuck? Hi, Aben. Hello. Is it pronounced Aben, or is it like Aben? Aben. Hello. Also, I think I got, I got like one reset, right? And it was Ray. Ray, thank you for the 6-1 reset, BB. I love you. Oh, head pass with a headache? Thank you. Meow. Meow. I had so much trouble today, so... I have... I have a banging selfie that I want to tweet. But I can't think of a caption. I am... Like, I was talking about this last night with chat. I am so bad at Twitter now. I don't know how to tweet anymore. I don't know what's funny and what isn't. Cause like I we were we were thinking like okay, a good caption for this photo would be like, it's getting cold. Like it's cold tonight. We should wanna curl up with me or whatever the fuck. But I already knew that if I tweeted that, someone would come in and be like, Why aren't you wearing a shirt then? Because I wasn't wearing a shirt in the photo. And I don't need that shit. I don't need that in my life. But also, I guess that's engagement, so we kind of ball. You know what? Maybe that's the vibe. Maybe that's it. Maybe I should have people just talk shit under my photos so it gets them to go around. But a bing bada boom, five head, right? You're not the only reason who had depression sleep. Uh, who had depression sleep, me to reason why I ended things with my sneaky link. What's a sneaky link? That sounds like some Toronto man shit. What's a sneaky link? Are you Toronto men's? All engagement is good engagement? I mean, I guess. Farming interactions? That's the way to go. I don't know how to do it anymore, though. I used to be so funny on Twitter. But no, I'm not! Red worst mod? No, you're so right. You're so right. He's terrible. He's awful. He's never here. He's always late. He talks shit all the fucking time. It's a friends of benefits you're hiding from other people because you're ashamed of them. Oh! Wait! What's the fucking point? Why hook up with someone because you're ashamed? How down fucking horrendous are you? I mean, I've been there, but like, what the fuck? Goddess, is there an Xbox version of this game? I actually don't... No. I feel like there isn't. I feel like this game Keep is only PC and PlayStation. I could be heart. super wrong. Thank you, Zane. Thank you for seeing my reset. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm just like away from my food. Do your thing. No PS5 and PC. See, I'm smart. See, I know things. I didn't need Red to tell me that. I can fucking figure that shit out on my own. What about something like Batty with a Vibe or something empowering like that? Batty with a Vibe? Do I look like the type of person that would caption my photo, Batty with a vibe? With the nail emoji? What do you mean, yes? What do you mean, yes? What the fuck? Have you seen the shit that I captioned my photos? Nah, I am being disrespected. What the 
Oh, fuck! Hey, Nissan, mostly lurking till end of raid, but I'm here. Hope y'all are having a great evening. Nissan, I'm gonna need you because Red isn't fucking modding tonight. Being a bitch. Ugh. Hi, is it Specarino? I pronounced that correctly? What's up? I'm the dude whose dick you've seen in Discord? Ray? I haven't even seen- No, never mind. I guess she ain't a baddie with a vibe. Wait, no, 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 no. Just because I wouldn't caption my photo baddie with a vibe does not mean I'm not a baddie with a vibe. Hold on. Nah, hold on. When does he mod? Never. You're so right. You're so right, Jin. He never mods. No. Ah. <sighs> okay, well, I'm cozy. Let's see if my Popeyes is here yet. Let's see. Knock, knock. I should be here soon then. A full sun image, no captions. Avalon? Avalon, Miss Girl? Hold on. Baddie with a vibe is low key terrible. I know. That's a horrible caption. It's a terrible caption. But I'm a baddie through and through, okay? And I refuse to let people tell me otherwise. <laughs> You have Popeyes today two parts? What'd you get? I just got some chicken nuggies. Like their little nugs. Okay, so I didn't know this, but I think the nugs are exclusive to Canada. Because I don't think American Popeyes has the nugs. No, I had them? Oh, you did? Right! Okay, so you guys do have the nuggets. Okay, so some of y'all just have shitty Popeyes then. Oh, sweeter than honey is a cute- Hey, that's a cute caption. Sweeter than honey? I like that one. I'm stealing that. If you ever see me use it, you could take full credit for it. I'll deny it. <laughs> Canada on top, I guess? Well, we are, I guess, you know, geographically on top. Oh my god, my office is so fucking hot. I can feel my makeup on my face. This is disgusting. This is awful. So, for those of you who wear makeup, like, y'all know. Y'all know what it's like to wear makeup in, in the summer, right? Like, that feeling? Holy shit. I'm gonna take this off. Ignore my titties, please. <laughs> I'm gonna get my armpit hair fucking clipped, and it's gonna be a whole another th another uh, Twitter thing. I can already see it. <laughs> my Popeyes is here. All right, let me go grab it. At least I'm wearing socks tonight. Y'all aren't getting free grippers tonight. God, I still hate that. I hate it. I hate it. Who the fuck started calling feet grippers? I fucking nah, terrible. Do you ever think that, like, my neighbors can hear me? I, I've never gotten a noise complaint, and my neighbors have never spoken to me about, well, me. Um, do, do you think that they, they ever hear me yell? Because I'm pretty loud. Hi, Mugu Yugu. I'm Mugu 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 Mugu. I know there's a baby beside me. We got a baby in the house. He want my chicken. I'm sure people <laughs> across half the city can hear you. No, you're so right. You're so right. I'm so loud for no reason. Well, your breath stinks again. I showed Sire the grippers for free and she freaked out. I did. That was the sexiest thing you've ever shown me, Ray. Can't believe you showed cross your cock, but I didn't get to see. I only got to see your feet. <laughs> Why is this a conversation I'm having? Out of context, this is terrible. <laughs> Not that there needs to be much context. <laughs> I'm ending this conversation. <laughs> that dog is hungry and hot, sweating like crazy. Nah, Waldo's fine. The t 
two centimeter defeater. The two. I will never forget the smallest PP I ever dealt with. I couldn't even. I couldn't. <laughs> I- there was nothing I could do. Do you know what I mean? I didn't know- I I couldn't- f like, I didn't know if it was in or not. I had to ask. Which already set the pace for the rest of the evening. And I couldn't perform. Because there was no- There wasn't enough room for me to move- There was just no fucking room! I couldn't do anything! I was just like, it's like putting like a lollipop in your mouth and holding it. And nothing wrong with that though. They're great. It was fun. But you know, we had to like make adjustments. Which is fine. It happens. There's literally nothing wrong with that. I just, I remember it because I felt so bad. I felt so bad. And not bad because it was small. Bad because, like, I made it awkward by being like, Is it in? And they're like, Yeah. <laughs> it is what it is. You always remember your first and your smalls. Nah, I wish I could fucking forget my first. Oh my god. My first was terrible that I became a self-proclaimed virgin. But that's a story for another day. That's because I was sexually assaulted. So. <laughs> and so I was like, yeah, nah, I'm good. That never happened, you know? Who is here? I run. Take care. Mm. Mm. Yeah, sorry, that got depressing real fucking quick. Alright. Anyway. Can I have a nuggie? Hell no. Nah. Never mind. If Waldo can't have nuggies, none of y'all can. I feel like I've forgotten half of the people I've slept with. And that is so sad. Like, the other day, I woke up- <gasps> Dentist! Dentist, thank you for the 10 gifted! I appreciate it! Thank you! Everybody, get to the sub. Welcome to Kevin with your bedrooms and your stay. Thank you! Mmm! I had a list too. But I got rid of it. But literally the other day, I woke up and I was like, oh my god. I slept with this one dude. At TwitchCon. And I completely forgot. I completely forgot it happened. I don't even talk to him anymore. I don't even know if he remembers me. I didn't fucking remember him. And he's just like huge streamer. And I was like, oh no. This is so bad. Fucking TwitchCon man. But that was- that was TwitchCon fucking- what was it, 2019? Or 2018? I don't know. I don't know. I only went to two. I went to I think 2017, 2019. What happens at TwitchCon? Say the TwitchCon? Exactly. Competitive ranked sex. Yo, what's your rank? Chat, if you had to rank yourself, what what would your placements be? 
Or if you had to place yourself, what would your rank be? No, that's too real. Gold, but like rusty? Ah, oh, so gold, but hasn't played in a while. I feel like... I feel like... I don't know what I'd be. Tarnished gold. Tarnished gold. No, I'm still playing quick play. <laughs> In and out! Boom! <laughs> Going against the AIs? Because <laughs> I've been playing solo for so long. Time to lurk and eat. Enjoy your foodie. Enjoy your foo foo. Mm. I don't see Waldo. This man is waiting. Mm. Hmm? 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 I gave him a crumb. And it hit his face. Now he's looking for it. Now he realized. See? See? Up. <laughs> Up. <laughs> there you go, baby. <laughs> Why did you cry? Why did you cry? Did y'all hear that? Yeah, he's fine. No, Waldo's fine. He's fine. Look at him. This dog is perfectly fine. He's just a little goblin. Hi, hey, baby. See? Yeah, he's just dramatic. Waldo is very dramatic. Yeah, so for those who don't know, this is my dog Waldo. He's a three-year-old Samiad. He'll be four in a month. Birthday is March 21st, the first day of spring. You want another piece? Yeah, I'll give you another piece. Hold on. Chat, what are we doing for his birthday? How are we going to celebrate? Oh my god, I have his hair all over my fingers. Ew. Is she just borrowing him? No, you're right, you're right. My bad. All those actually gins, baby. He's the daddy, my bad. Cooking stream? Am I gonna make Waldo a meal? I'm gonna blow up the home. I can't cook. Bake him a cake. Oh my god, dog cam all day? Hell yeah. Okay, ready? Are you ready? You want foot? I want foot? Yeah, thank you, baby. Hey, you go, mama. Look at him! Look at him! Look at that little boy! Oh my god, you're so handsome! Oh my god, you're so handsome, I love you. Yeah, thank you. Can I get a kiss? Can I get another kiss? One kiss. You're not gonna give me a kiss? Alright, fine. <laughs> okay, all done. All gone. All gone, boo boos. All gone, boo boos. All gone. How is that breath though? Eh. Eh. It's not that good today. Gotta brush his teethies. 
Yeah, he got chicken breath. Okay. So today we're gonna do some MSQ. My game has not DC'd, so we actually might be okay. I'm scared though. Because I fucking called it. Alize's quest has to do with Gabu. So we're gonna be, I believe, trying to get Gabu to speak. I'm gonna cry. I look too good right now. I can't risk it. I don't wanna cry. How is Waldo like the non existent pillow of Ratman? Oh, Waldo doesn't care. Waldo is unfazed by everything in my background, don't worry. He's used to my garbage. Pet Waldo again? Okay. Okay. This is my last nug. Mmm. There you go. Mm. He needs a pet? Bet. There you go. Is that what you want to see? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at him. Are we good? We're good. Uh, why do Popeye's biscuits go so hard? Like, this should not be this good. They're so salty. And soft, but like a little crunchy. Like, hello? Mmm. Mmm. Too salty? Nah. You have the right amount of salt for me. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. I think my PC is organized the way I want it to be. Look what happened to my smoothie. Hey, Sega. What's up? Oh, hey, Ken. Hello. Elise, how are you? How was your ramen? Did you have a good night? Were you out with your parents again? I don't remember if I read that in chat or if I am just misremembering. Okay. I think. How important is money to you? Very important. I have a dog to take care of. I have myself to take care of. I have rent to pay. I have bills to pay. I have a townhouse to pay off. Money is very important to me. Money should be important to most people. It's not like the top of my list of priorities, but it is something that's important. And whoever says money can't buy happiness is a liar. Money may not be able to buy like permanent happiness, but it can buy temporary happiness. And it could also add to like happiness down the road. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't want money to be as important as it is, but to any but anybody who says otherwise is lying. Money buys freedom, which is happiness. Money can buy you a plane ticket. Money can put food on the table. Money pays your bills. Money keeps you alive. It's the sad reality because you need it money buys security there you go beautiful money buys security which buys happiness beautifully put money buys me emmett self pillows exactly money bought me my dog which is my i guess permanent well not permanent but is my happiness 
If it weren't for my dog, I wouldn't be able to get out of bed. If it weren't for my dog, I probably would not be here right now. Can money buy connection? What are you... What are you implying here? What kind of connection? Like... No! Sorry, baby. Money can buy a USB cable? True. Money can buy me... A vibrator? Because I don't need the stress of another person in my life. Bada bing bada boom. <laughs> Money buys me Twitch subs? Pay up. <laughs> buzz buzz. <laughs> Money can buy you a subscription to Critical Claim MORPG Final Fantasy 14. So true, bestie. So true. Money can buy you a sub to my fan house. Beautiful. Corrigan, thank you for the sub. And Dentist, thank you for the five gifted. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I was told to pay up. I appreciate it. I appreciate you paying the Syra tax. Now, if only everybody else would. Come on. I'm waiting. Gangsters, what's up, guys? Money buys bits too. True? True? Sloppy. For 50 bits? You... Money can buy you 50 bits for sloppy. <laughs> Who needs sloppy toppy when you... <laughs> oh my god, for 50 bits you can get some sloppy toppy in my chat. Oh my god. I want to I wanna see if I could do like an edit of that and have it be sloppy toppy. <laughs> sloppy toppy. <laughs> Wow! Look at that. This for Waldo we connected now. <laughs> Sloppy. <laughs> thank you for the five dollar dono mark. Sloppy. Thank you for the for the sloppy biddies. How sloppy? Got it. You gotta find out the hard way. Pars, thank you for gifting a sub. Thank you. Look at that. Look at you all coming together and paying the sire tax. So there you have it. Money buys me happiness. <laughs> There's your answer. It's for Waldo? Sorry. Thank you for giving Waldo $5. Oh my god, you know what? I should get like a little piggy bank for Waldo. And I can put money in it. And then when he gets enough money, I can buy him treats. Wouldn't that be so cute whenever Waldo's good? I put an extra toonie in there. He get his money. And then we go to the store and we buy stuff with the money. My hardworking boy. Yeah, my hardworking booba. God, he's so fucking round. Chat, hold on. Let me let me take a photo of him. Waldo, you better not move. Thank you. Look at that. Look how big he is. I know there's a camera here, but if I move to, to grab the camera, he'll uh he'll run away. Hi baby! Oh my god, Here, let me let me do a, like a, a comparison. Let me show you my hand on him. He is an absolute fucking monstrosity. He is so big. Sarah looking like an absolute queen rebel dead violet love. Rebel dead violet love. Thank you for the 26 months. Oh, look, how are you? It's nice to see you. I hope you're doing well. Waldo fan house when? I do post him on my fan house pretty frequently. Not as much as I used to. I gotta, I gotta step my game up a little bit. Yeah, we love a big boy. I need a big boy. Waldo's my big boy. 
He my big boy. Wow, wow. What if there were a fan house sister pets called Dog House? Oh my god, I would love that. I would have a page for Waldo, like, in a heartbeat. Hello, Grits. May Waldo's floof sustain your emotions well-being. Thank you. Very kind of you. <laughs> okay, my headache is still headaching. So give me one second, chat. I'm just going to take another Advil. And then we'll... We'll do the thing. We'll play the game. We'll game play. Game be play. Play play. Be right back.
Oh my god, Ray and his fucking massive titties sitting beside me? Fuck yes, dude. Okay, I'm here. Um, so because I updated my stream, or OBS rather, finally, I want to try something, okay? So normally I have chat up here. Um, I don't like how chat looks um, with this. Like, I think this just does not look good for gameplay. So I want to try putting in this on. I don't know if putting the browser will work. Oh my god. Wait. Hold on, am I a fucking genius? Wait. Am I smart? Did it work? I don't know if it did. No, I don't think it did. Hold on. Let me do it. I don't know. I don't know if that's gonna work. I'm just waiting for spring to start soon. Honestly, same. Me fucking too. You know what? I actually don't want to toggle with this right now, so we'll just have it like this for now. I, yeah, I'm honestly, we had a taste of spring the other day. And it was so good. It was so fucking good. We had spring for about a week. And now we're in the trenches again. It's minus 16 in Toronto. I am not okay. This is not acceptable. Alright. Are we ready? Is it gameplay time? It's gameplay time. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alrighty. Okie dokie. Hi, Beans. Hello, Beans. Alright, so we are doing Alize's quest. Oh, let me switch to FF real quick. I forgot to do that. Final fantasy. 14. God, I can't believe how embarrassingly obsessed with this game I am. I avoided this game like the plague for so long. And now, it's all I play. I'm ashamed. I'm so ashamed. Right, Mordona. Right! Yes! Uh, Tataru has... What does she have? She has a ship for us now, right? I've never been anywhere colder than minus 20. Really? I think the coldest I've ever endured was like minus 25. It gets fucking cold sometimes here. Like unbearably cold. But we we persevere. Hi, Keep. Hello. Not much. Not much. How you doing? Why did you avoid? Because I knew that once I started playing this game, I would never see the light of day. And this game, it absorbs me. It got me. It got me good. Okay, let me... Let me see something real quick. If I... If I do... If I do this... Mm, I still don't like how that looks. But how does that... Is that gonna... No, okay. Cool. That's the best I can do. I'll figure it out later. We'll play around with the chat box at a... Oh my god, at another time. I have to sneeze. <laughs> okay, I'm good. Okay. Our average winter low is 2 degrees Celsius and the average summer high is 20 Celsius? Really? Damn. God, I wish the average high was 20 C here. I mean, I guess like it kind of is, but that's... Well, we have we have bad moments in Toronto. Thank you. That was the most adorable sneeze. Please don't clip it. There was a phase um, yes, where... Is. What's up, guys? Bless you. Thank you for the 100... Oh my god, it's freezing. OBS is freezing. I fucking updated it, thinking that would help. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna have to have chat popped out again. 
Why does it fucking do this? Like, OBS will only freeze when I'm, like, not clicked on it. Maybe I have to run as admin because I don't think I'm running as admin. No, it should be auto running as admin. Have you tried warming it up? Yeah, I put it in the microwave and it almost exploded, so not doing that again. Okay. Well, I have chat open now, so we're chilling. Okay. Oh yes, the bonanza, right. Okay, so I can skip this because we did do this yesterday, um, but I DC'd right when the cutscene began, like right when we were uh, walking into the ship. Yeah, and she's the pilot, right? Yes. All right, cool. And now we're good. Hi, Ricky. How are you? Also, again, thank you for the biddies, dentist. I don't know if I thanked you or not, but thank you. There we go. This is where I DC'd yesterday. Oh, what a boot of me right here. Hell yeah. Hello, Mr. Tia. Did I ever mention that I was fond of flying? Because I am. Be it on an airship, an Amaro, or a Chocobo, there's nothing so exhilarating as feeling the wind on your face as the horizon unfolds before you. Oh god, you're so cute. You're so fucking cute. You're so- f Oh, I love my wife. Oh my god, and my wife is so short! He's so short! Why is he looking at me like that? Why are you giving me those bedroom eyes? What the fuck? Alright, hey, Elise. Honestly, Sid would be jealous of the way that airship flies. Tataru has not done herself. Anyway, here we are on, Az on Azisla. I forgot how to pronounce it. Azisla? Azisla? And Alfino's report did not do the scale of this place justice. Oh my god, I'm actually getting experience because I'm playing as a Reaper. <laughs> Holy shit. You know what I should do? I should level Gunbreaker. So that's the fucking tank, cl uh, tank class that I play in Endwalker. Okay, the Wisdom of Alec. Gratia surveys surveys his surroundings with an expectant glint in his eye. The Emmet Silk Shrine in the back is immaculate. Look, I wouldn't call it a shrine because it's just a body pillow and a portrait of him. It's the Orshifon Shrine that you should be worried about. Because I have a little keychain here. I have two plushies and a portrait of him. I don't know if you can see it though. You can, you can kind of see it. The portrait is out of the frame, though. I have another Orshapon plushie on its way, and I'm so excited. It's gonna be my emotional support plushie, so whenever I'm sad, I'll just grab it and cry. That's what I was doing with the with the portrait of him. I have so many screen caps of me crying, just holding the portrait of Orshapon. <laughs> is that an ether right? It is! Oh, and the rug! Emmy, you're right. How could I forget my rug? See, money does buy me happiness. It buys me 11 nugs from Dragon Age and Orshifant uh, merchandise. <laughs> Hi, Arbsy. Arbsy? Am I pronouncing that correctly? Did I quit drinking beer for good and start drinking beer for evil? Hell yeah, Omni. Good for you. This appears to be the Helix, which means we stand in the Alpha Quadrant. To East... To the east lies the Beta Quadrant, and yes, I believe I have my bearings. Though this is my first time on Azisla, I do have some familiarity with the place thanks to the records in the Crystal Tower. Unless I am mistaken, this leads to an etherite, beyond which there will be an information terminal. I just will begin our search there. Okay, wifey, let's go. Da -na -na -na. I did perfect. Good, good, good. All right, have to bounce for work. Have a great stream. Sorry, enjoy chat. Bye, Mango. Thank you for popping in for a little bit. It was nice seeing you. Take care. Okay, which way? Uh, oh, go this way. I have not been here like properly since um, Heaven's Ward. So this is kind of wild. Hello. Hello. Did you make the etherite? I did not. I did not. The etherite is from Etsy. Also, how do I pronounce your name? Is it Flo Flostum? 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 Tummy? Tum Tum? Floss? And my money buys you the etherite and the one ring. So true. Shout out to Dentist and his money. Get you a rug of your husband? Who knew? Yeah, well, that way I can step on him, you know? 
And here is the terminal. A moment while I research the archives for references to tempering. Oh, cutscene. Please be voiced for me. Ah, there we are. Dude, why why is Graha's hands like this? He said What the fuck? Hey Ben, what's up? Hey, what is this? What is this? There we are, there we have it. Iconic corruption. Icon and overview. That sounds promising. Indeed. Let us see what this report has to say. Hmm? Confound it. The contents appear to have been deleted. That's the cat boy claw? All the cat blo all the cat boys got their hands like that? I'm so glad I've never noticed. He's gotta put those grippers away. What? No. Isn't there something you can do? Not from here, I'm afraid. But it may but it may be that another copy of the report exists elsewhere. The question is where to look. It says here the report was written by someone named Owen. Is it likely that he kept a copy? I would say it is a distinct it is a distinct possibility. Assuming he was a researcher here, he will have had quarters on the habisphere. We can ascertain the details on habisphere control. Let us return to the Bonanza and avail ourselves of the mana cutters. We will need them to reach, to reach our destination. I forgot. You already have a suitable means of transport, don't you? No need to waste, a ta to waste time accompanying us back to the ship, then. We'll see you at the Habisphere. But what if I wanted to hang out with you two? You two are my babies! <laughs> what the fuck? Alright, well, I guess I'll balloon my way over. Where am I going? Um, oh, okay, we're going over there. God, I still have uncharted territory here, huh? Maybe I should just quickly go unlock those areas. And I will do so as a gunbreaker and just get a smidgen of XP. Just a smidge. I'm Simpin does that hooked hand thing when he's shocked. I hate that. Yoshi P, fix it. You've given the cat boys a flaw, and it's the grippers, the hand grippers. Miasma, hello! What's up? What's up, Billy? How are you? Am I actually gonna buy stuff in the mod station? Oh, what are you gonna buy? Oh, the balloon? The balloon mount? It's so good. I love it. It's so dumb. Look at her. Look at me go. Damn, look at Pepper's legs! God damn, Pep! Okay, let's see. Wait, 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 wait. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Here we go. Let's see. Let's unlock this area here. And then we'll go this way. Wow, it's pretty here. Ominously pretty, of course. Ooh, a lookout spot! Wonder if it's a lookout or if it's just, um prey or something. Oh, right. I'm mounted. My bad. Hell yeah. Alright, let's keep going. One of these days I want to try getting as many of the lookout spots as I can. Maybe do like a look uh, like a little uh, farming stream. I still have hot chocolate to give you? You're so mean. Well, come find me. Oh, that's what I wanted to do today. I wanted to make hot chalky. I didn't make my hot chocolate. Oh, there's a dungeon over here. What is the dungeon here? Wait, what is this? What is this? I'm assuming I'll unlock it during some sort of quest. Is this the entrance? Well, it seems closed right now. There's a dungeon, babes. Wow. Oh. All right, okay. And so now we go, the oh, there's someone I can play cards with! Triple triad time? As a treat? For me? 
Oh my gun breakers at level no, these are like level 80 quests. No, I still have a bit of a way to go. Never mind. I was gonna say, oh I could probably do it, but I can't. Okay, let's see. Where's the triple triad dude? I found him! Idol Imperial. And it's a cowboy! Let's fucking go. He got little things. Oh my god! Four? Four that I've never gotten? A uh, swap and chaos. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. I got this. Do you like spicy hot chocolate? Spicy hot chocolate? I don't think I've ever had spicy hot chocolate. That sounds like it'll upset my stomach. Bruh. This is not a good idea. I can't capture it. But fuck it, I'll put it here. It's fine. <sighs> fuck me. Fuck me, and that's high too. Shh. Oh, I can put this here. I can put this here. I'm gonna put it here. Okay. Oh no. I fucked myself. I fucked myself. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Born insane. Thank you for so much, Risa. I appreciate it. Oh! I won! Welcome to the Covenant of Drew Badger. Must inner stay. Match fee is 30 and I got 124 back. Let's fucking go. I didn't get a card though. No! You took my. No fucking shot. You took my good card. Bro! What the fuck is this? No, I can't. I need to I need to get a deck I need to get like a non monster deck, I guess. Uh, I'll put you here. Please, thank you. I will put you here because I can't cap that, but someone can cap this. Okay. And then this one, I'll put that there. Wait, that's my own card! Fuck! That was my own card. Oh my god, I fumbled the bag. I fumbled the fucking bag. Oh my god! Can I make this bigger, by chance? Let's see, my camera blocks it though. That's good. <sighs> Fuck. Fucking, you gave me this dog shit card again? Bro, give me something good! Give me a fair trade! What is this shit? Um... I'll just put it here, whatever. I'll take that card. Should have put it there though. Um I fucked up. I fucked up again. Hi. Hi Sora! Thank you for the two months resub. How are you? Fuck. Fuck. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Do I keep going? No, nah, I got a missions to do. I'll come back. I'll come back. I now know he's here. There's a coffee place near me that serves that and spicy- SPICY DONUTS?! Some- add some ancho chipotle power and you're cooking? Hmm. Okay. I may have to try that then. Look, if you're gonna vouch- If y'all are gonna vouch for it, then I will try it. Doing Heaven's Road side quest? No, I am doing MSQ. We are in 5.4 and Alize and Grahatia made me come here. Because for some reason. I actually don't remember why we're here. I think we're trying to find... Um, find out how we can help Gabu. <laughs> I am missing a little bit of context and I'm a little bit ashamed, but we ball. Okay, let me see if I can just quickly unlock this area. That's all the way up here. I would swear all my earthly belongs to the fact that spicy hot chocolate is good in. Okay, that's a huge vouch. See, I would never go that far. I don't think I'd vouch for anything that hard, but I trust you. Okay, the wisdom of Alec. Oh, I can't even, like... Let me see. Where is it? Where the fuck is it? Oh, there it is. That doesn't help me! 
just get rid of that. Okay, I did it. I did it. We got all the areas here. Perfect. And I got the spicy XP. Alright, now we can go back to MSQ. So is that but spicy chocolate stuff isn't like ah spicy like ooh spicy yeah it's like it's like a like a hint right okay that kind of spicy not like like more zesty I guess you could say nah not zesty zesty is not the right word either okay let me swap classes let's go back to Reaper oh girl you got your titties out you got your titties out. What are you giving me? Oh my god, the hot chocolate. Here, let me put this here. <gasps> Five hot chockies? Thank you. And an onion? I'll give you some pee. Here. Enjoy your pee. And enjoy your weed. I got you, bestie. Oh my god. And spaghetti? Bruh. I am being spoiled. Hell yeah. I'm zesty? Thank you. Wait, what? You got no inventory space, bestie. Clear it up. I'm trying to give you Swede. What do you mean trade canceled? What do you mean? You're not going to give me my hot chalky now? Is it because I insulted you for being topless? All right, well, I'm continuing. I'm oh. Never mind. Ah. Okay, he's giving me the spaghetti and no more hot chocolate. I see how it is. Oh, there's the hot chocolate. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You're doing great. You're doing great. And the wild onion. Thank you. You only get pissed now. It's tough out here for a weed dealer. I know. No one no one wants my sweet anymore. And a feather? You're giving me a fe- Make up your mind! Do you see this? He said, nah, you ain't getting no fucking onion now. <laughs> Fuck you too! If the late Owen did indeed have a chamber here, this node will be able to tell us its number. Cutscene time? No. I love that it looks like Alize is wearing ice skates. There. From what I recall of the layout, it should be somewhere in this in the vicinity of Hmm? Warning. An evacuation order is presently in effect. Entry to the hapisphere is not permitted at this time. Foiled again. In all likelihood, the order would have been imposed during the fourth umbral calamity, and I doubt it will be lifted in the near future. Bzz, energy level critical. Returning to base for recharging. Well, surely there must be some other way to gain access. Force, for example? Hmm, here we, re here we resort to that. I have an idea. Were we to send a surge of energy through yonder control mechanism, it should prompt us to restart, releasing the locks. As for a suitable energy source, a concentrated lightning shard might suffice. Happily, I seem to recall that they are known to form at points of stagnant ether throughout the continent. You seem to recall? Are you honestly telling me that was in the records too? Ha! I am. Reports since the capital mentioned that lightning aspected ether was prone to pooling on the continent, resulting in surges that interfered with equipment. A minor detail, I grant you, but in my role as caretaker of the Crystal Tower, there was no such thing as too much elegant knowledge. I just realized I don't have my MSQ ears on. My MS queers, if you will. Oh my god. My microphone? My mic? Can you be stable for one fucking second? I am begging you. I am begging you to be, to be stable. Okay. My MS queers. There we go. Let me fix them up a bit. Oh my god, my ears. Still doing weed for headpads? Of course. At least I think that's still my um my search info. 
That sounds too close to my self-talk. <laughs> me to me every day. <laughs> yeah, but it doesn't work. Imagine being stable. Literally could not be me. In this economy, in this day and age, fuck no. I'm a disaster. Can't ask your mic to be stable when no one here is true. The mic is just trying to blend in. I'm asking too much of it. Y'all, my headache is still headaching. I'm trying my best to not, like, pass away. Okay. The queers are on. Hello, Mr. Happy. I know. We don't like headaches in this household. I ouchie. I ouchie really bad. But I'll be fine. A minor detail, like, oh, I already read that. Besides, my studies help me to feel connected to the source. To home. Aww, puppy. I must have explored this facility a thousand times in my mind, but to finally stand here with the two of you, it is more exhilarating that I, than I can well express. Aww. Now then, the lightning shard. If I may, I suggest we split up and search the beta quadrant. Oh, but beware of sprites. They are want. They are want to manifest. They are want. They are want. They are want. They are want to manifest where the ether is stagnant. Now you're just showing off, which makes me think we should make a contest of this. The first to return here with the shard wins. What do you say? Very well. It would be my honor to come third. Oh, oh, he's. Oh my God. I. Okay. How can you not sim for Grahatia? Like, how could you not sim for him? He, he, he is so fucking cute. He is such, he's so down bad. I love him. He's a fucking puppy. Hello? Oh, can I, can I be of assistance to you? What? You give me head pets? Oh, I got fucking smacked instead? <laughs> Bitch! Bitch! I fucking got it. I got you, bitch. Leave me alone. Nah. No kisses. No! No! Okay, where am I going? Find a point of stagnant lightning and defeat the lightning sprites that appear. Okay, so we're gonna go all the way up here. Graha is my precious cat boy. He is, he is our wife. That is our wife, chat. Girl is absolutely stupid for the warrior of light, and in my case, it's absolutely reciprocated. Aww. I don't know how Pepper feels about Grahatia. I haven't quite decided yet. Hello? Hello? You're just chilling here? Okay. So it's over here. Do I have to go down here? Orps flower? Wait. Yo, this is sick. Okay, is it here? Is it this? Oh shit. Love this, what an exhilarating battle. Incredible. Truly, truly incredible. Wow. So much is happening. He is very male wife material. He is! He absolutely is! And I refuse to hear otherwise. Okay, I got my little lightning. My little lightning guy. Is this gonna be voiced? I guess not. Bravo! That was quite a show adventure. Why, the spectacle proved so enthralling that all thoughts of the prize slipped my mind. Wait, what? Who is this? I appear to have for uh got forfeit. Yeah. I appear to have forfeited our little race. Congratulations, the lightning shard is yours. Wait, what? Graha Tia? No. Very funny, now let's get back to work. What? Wait, what? No dramatic entrance? You've changed. You changed? Do I know who this is? Oh, 
Oh, it is him! Oh, Ugh, you remember that? In my defense, I was caught up in the moment. This isn't every day you meet an, an honest-to-gods hero, after all. <laughs> what? Why is he... Why is he such a puppy? He's playing games? He's playing hide-and-seek? He's toying with me? In the middle of a mission? Well, the contest continues, so you had better hurry back. Ah, uh, but one last thing. What? Thank you, Pepper, for bringing me here. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, you're so welcome. Thank you for joining us. I'm happy to have you with us. Don't mention it. I want to bite his ankles. I just want to... Actually, I'm sure he'd love to bite mine, too. And my pillows. But that's fine. With the pegging commence. Okay, where am I going? Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Maybe he isn't as bad as I remember. Red, you're just jealous that he's the better red cat boy. He's got the red eyes. He's got the red hair. And you got pink on you? You ain't even full red. Hey Saints, what's up? Oh, my bad. Didn't mean to talk to you, Alize. You have a shard? Then you win. I searched high and low, but couldn't find such a, so much as a trace of stagnant ether. It appears Alize had no luck, so victory is yours. Congratulations. Now then, may I have the shard? Here you go, pipes. What is it that makes you so much better at finding things? What do you have that I don't? I don't know. Nice tits. Pretty long hair. A big red bow. Well, you have a red bow, but mine's better. That is a question I too have asked myself for myself on numerous occasions. I suspect we could both learn a great deal from Pepper. And not only about the series adventuring. What do you mean by that? <laughs> but come, we should attend to our mission. Voice acted cutscene for me as a treat. No. Excellent. The system responded exactly as intended. We now have access to the Hapisphere. Only one obstacle remains the security systems within. Should they be triggered, they can make life rather difficult for us. In light of which, pray leave the rest to me. If I am right, my royal blood should allow me to venture in unmolested. Sir, I hate that. I hate that term. <laughs> Assuming this place works like the Crystal Tower, yes. But if it doesn't, you'll be on your own. I want you to promise us that you'll get out at the first sign of trouble. I promise. Wish me luck. I don't trust him. He. We're gonna have to go rescue him. He's gonna get up to some tomfoolery, isn't he? And there he goes. Well, nothing for it but to sit tight. Sarah Coven. Gino, Gino, Geno, Geno, no, 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 Gino. Thank you for so much, Risa. I appreciate it. Welcome back to the Bedroom of Nunes Day. Aw, we're just vibing. No, I really thought this would be voiced. Oh my god, look how pretty Pepper looks. Sorry, I know, Alize, you're having a moment, but look at Pep. Look at Pep. Look at Miss Pep. Look at this bitch. She is so fucking cute. I cannot. I cannot handle her. Look at that. Look at those round cheeks. I'm sure this Owen... Wait, actually, I'm going to take a screenshot of this real quick because this would be a great reference for, the, uh, for a commission I'm getting right now. Hold on. There we go. Okay. I'm sure this Owen fellow was very learned, but Icon Corruption, an overview, sounds like a studium thesis. We all had to write one. Lest you wonder, mine was about the combat combat applications of ether. I'm nothing if not practical. Malfi knows is more philosophical, of course. Political, dare I say it. Oh, an even better one. Hold on. Gotta get the braid when it's up. Ah! Ah! Okay, I think I got it. He chose to write a lengthy discourse on our nation's duty to the world. That is so on brand. A controversial subject, to say the least. 
He asserted that Charlian's knowledge should rightly be used to protect all life on the star, in direct opposition to the country's cherished, pol cherished policy of non non intervention. Being a leading member of the forum, our father was not happy. Do I ever get to meet their parents? I hope so. I hope they're not dead. They kind of give off like orphan vibes, but. At the time, of course, Alfino was utterly convinced of his views and would cheerfully agree argue to the death with anyone who saw things differently. By which, I mean, the rows were long. To be fair to him, though, he's since learned to be a little more open-minded, but deep down, he still holds fast to that one belief, and I admire him for that. I should have liked to meet the young Alfino. For what it's worth, my, my thesis concerned the elegant civilization as depicted in folklore. Oh, you're back. I didn't know you attended the studium. I didn't. A thesis was required to earn my Archon's mark. My peers the students of Baldessian convinced me to write one with the promise of unfettered access to forbidden tomes. Though I considered it no more than a means to an end at t t a mean than a means to an end at the time, I'll admit it was gratifying to have my efforts acknowledged. Good gods, an Archon's thesis. I started to imagine the work involved. But enough, the, but enough about that. Whoa. But enough about that. Is this the fruit of your foray? Wait a minute. Why am I getting the vibe that Alize and Alfino are going to go back and somehow write this thesis and then become an Archon? I can see it. I can see it. Yes. Owen's archive node was waiting for me in his chamber. If a copy of his report still survives, it would be stored in this device. Shall we find out? God, these cutscenes have gotten so much better. Like, the quality of this game is just... It's just so good. Beep. Initializing. Scanning for a registered user. User not found. To proceed as a guest, please complete biometric authentication. Beep. <laughs> Verifying. Authentication complete. Guest identified as member of the royal family. I am at your most humble service, your highness. Your highness? <laughs> it never ceases to amuse me. It is but a pity the effect will not last forever. Doga, Doga and, and Une. Oh my god, were those the two who got sucked into the void of sea? Said as much as, as much when they granted me this gift. But until such time as it fades, I shall use it gratefully. Search archive for icon corruption or iconic corruption. Leap. Searching. Loop. One item found. Iconic corruption. An overview. The report is locked by the author. Please state password. Oh. Well, go on then, your highness. Tell the nice node the password. <laughs> the uh right. Uh, let's see. Glory be to Alec. Oh. Did they change it? That doesn't sound like a good thing. Long live Emperor Zand- Is it pronounced Zandy? Zande? I don't remember. Come on, Crystal Tower references. Bloop, bloop. Password incorrect. Please try again. Confound it. Home now. Passwords are invariably short and simple. For instance. The fucking drama. Well. Password. I swear to fucking God if she's right. I swear to God, if it's password. <laughs> the drama! The notion that the password could be something so inane would be laughable were it not dangerously stupid. Furthermore, your conduct in the presence of his highness is grossly inappropriate. Know your place, handmaiden. Oh my god! Oh my god! God! Bro! The known club bag! Yo, fuck this basketball! God damn, she got orbed! Wow. 
what did this thing just call me? Oh no. A wild rose, courage. Let's let's try courage. Bloop, bloop. Password incorrect. Again, be warned that any further inappropriate behavior in the presence of His Highness will not be tolerated. Good God. All right, that's it. I see we dismantle it and manually extract what we need. <laughs> How is say you feisty little bean? Now, now, let's not be too hasty. Exists. Thank you, Sunday's gone, for giving me a three-month reset and for existing for all of us. I appreciate it. A single misstep and we risk losing the report altogether. I believe this may be a task for Sid and his colleagues. If anyone can coax Machina into cooperating, it is them. Well, all right. Come, let us spread the note back to the Rising Stones. Well, at least we're done here. I don't like the musty air here. Food! Oven meatballs, herring pie, silky pudding. I kind of want to get the pie. But I also want to kind of get the money. I'm poor. I'm going to take the money. I guess I could sell the food, but whatever. Reviving the legacy. Grahatia seems eager to bear the note away. I should probably mention that I have yet to meet Sid since waking up. Rambrose did send word to the ironworks, but it appears our friend has been afield on urgent business. Nevertheless, I assure you my proposal to seek his help is no pretext, however much I might look forward to seeing him again. Him and everyone- oh, him and everyone. But come, let us be on our way. And we are off. With the bait, with the baseball, the basketball, the soccer ball. Hee! <laughs> Look at him, all but running. How sweet. Still, so, wouldn't do to keep him waiting, shall we? I hate reading, um, reading hee hee hees, cause like I don't want to fucking giggle. Why are ninety percent of your IG posts UFT? When the fuck have I posted UFT? I don't think I've ever shot at U of T. I think I've shot there once. Yeah, once. I only have one photo set there. Wow, you don't know Toronto well, do you? Hmm? Hmm? This one? This is the only set there, so what do you mean 90%? Come on, pretend monkey, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Welcome to come to your bedroom soon day. There's another one on campus, who knows? No, there isn't. There's literally not another one at U of T. I'm not gonna dox myself either. Toronto's beautiful, maybe you should explore it better. Wait, hello? Are you giving me weapons? Hell yeah, thank you. Wait, where are you? Oh, and a map? Hell yeah. Oh, there you are, oh my god, your head. So we're going back to the Rising Stones, yeah? Pray you return. Is it the Rising Stones? It's the Waking Sands of Rising Stones, yeah. Because it's death more than one? It's not. It's not. I don't know what you're trying to do here, my guy, but it's not. I can tell you right now, those are the only photos I have there. All right? Why the fuck would I be lying? But I'm not going to dox myself, so I'm not going to tell you where the other places are. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. I go to UFT. I was just on your Instagram. 90% of your photos are at... Miss me. Miss me with that. Okay. Let's go in here, then. They're glam weapons? I assume so. I, the second I saw the... um. The level, I I knew. I put two and two together. Just got called into work for a midnight shift. Oh no! Does that mean you're abandoning us? Goodbye, Ricky. Godspeed with work. Take care. Or don't go. And be a rebel. With us.
Wonderful news, Pepper. Tataru contacted Sid on our behalf, and he is on his way here even as we speak. While we wait, I should like very much to hear what transpired at the Alliance Council. Would you be so kind, Kryle? Oh my god, please be voiced. As you know, the meeting we was the meeting was convened to discuss how best to respond to reasons of recent events in Garlemald. Oh right, I forgot about that because what's her face? Lise came here and was like, "I've got a meeting that I want you to attend to. Do you think you can make it back to Alamigo?" And I said, "No, I fucking hate Alamigo. I'm not going there, dude." Alamigo is literally like the I fucking hate. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. It's garbage. It's garbage. It's garbage. Like, they gave us little Alamigo, and it sucked, and then they gave us the full Alamigo, and it was even worse. It was terrible. Oh my god, look who's- look who the- look who it is. I talk about shitty things, and another shitty thing fucking spawns. What's up, J3? Hi, friend. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, that was mean. I'm so sorry. I don't take it back, but I am sorry. I hope your stream was good, you were streaming all day. And I was lurking all day. So don't fucking don't fucking come here and tell me, oh you never watch my stream. Oh you're never there. But I hope you got a good I hope you had a good stream. What's up, friends? I'm Syrah. I'm a Final Fantasy 14 streamer. My eyelashes are popping off now. Can you can you guys can you not spam in my chat, please and thank you? Mods! Mods! Alright. Back to, back to the, uh, the drama. <laughs> Are those ears real? Yes. Yes, that's why they match my hair so perfectly. The traveling eyelash makes it return. No, 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 no. Listen, I'm not crying yet, so it's not going to be flying anywhere anytime soon, all right? According to intelligence from our Doman allies, the war of succession rages on, and the empire remains without a leader. Oh my god, I fucking forgot they killed the dude. But isn't Xenos alive? So what is- isn't Xenos taking the throne? Or I guess they don't know that yet, right? Oh right, yeah, I guess this is like speculation. My day is good! Why the fuck am I here? Wow, rude! Hello? Hello? Your favorite streamer drags you in here and you complain? Tisk tisk. Elamigans already deal with so much oppression. <laughs> oh my god, I know. I will never forget my first impression of Stormblood. I was like, oh my god, these poor people. And then Lise opened her mouth and she cried, woe is me. <sighs> and now they have to deal with her? With her as their leader? I mean, like, at least they got Roban helping them, right? Amidst the chaos, the Imperial Legions and the provinces have begun to move independently of the motherland. Of greatest concern to us is the... The third, uh, the third, <laughs> a legion aligned with Lord Nerva. It appears they have received substantial financial backing from House Brutus. What the fuck is House Brutus? Why am I shocked? I don't know who that is. Did I miss something? <laughs> Brutus, aren't they the ones who took in Yotsuyu? Ah, Yotsuyu and Asahi? This bodes well. I think Asahi's alive. I think he's the one that's not alive, but he's the one being like puppeted. Isn't he? He is, right? Wait, I know this. I already know this. Do I know this? I don't know. I haven't done MSQ in a hot minute. I literally don't remember what I already know. This is so bad. Zeno's movements, meanwhile, remain shrouded in mystery. We're hoping that Thanker and Uriange will be able to shed some light on his activities when they return. Until such time as they do, the allied leaders feel it would be unwise to interfere in the conflict. And so, thanks in part to the Imperial withdrawal from Gimlet, they have decided to turn their attention to the primal problem once more. Do you play Overwatch 2? No, I don't. I actually care about my well-being and I like myself. No, I don't I don't play Overwatch not anymore. I stopped playing Overwatch back in like 2019. I cold turkey it. I was like, I'm not fucking doing this anymore. I played Overwatch 2 for a little bit when it came out, but I have arthritis and it hurt. It hurt playing, so I just I haven't touched it since. And honestly, I'm keeping it that way. My name goes hard, it does. MILF's in bed. 10 out of 10. Beautiful. Thank god Raban is there to hold things together. Oh well, I had read least, but I'm gonna be nice. <laughs> There's- I think we only have one least simp in the chat and it's red. 
I actually don't know people who, who like, like Lise, apart from... There's, there's a very small portion of people I know that like Lise, and the people who like Lise, it's like unsurprising. Does that make sense? She's a poorly written character who has now grown on me. And you know what everyone says, what I've noticed? You don't like Lise because she's she's a bimbo. You don't like Lise because she's blonde and has blue eyes. If she was a man, everyone would love her. Why do I love Minfilia? Why did I love Reen? What is that argument? Lise sucks. She's garbage. Sorry. That's aggressive. But like the, my first like big impression of Lise was literally when we were in the Alamegan what was it? Okay, my chat is like bugging. OBS is like freaking out. Um, we were in the um, the little village or no, not village. I don't know what you uh, settlement. We were in a small settlement, and Lise is like crying to all these people, like you have to help us, you have to support us, we need to defeat the empire, fight with us. And everyone was like, nah, my family. Just got taken away from me. They were killed in front of me. I'm a slave now to the Empire. I'm this and the other. I'm a survivor. Blah, blah, blah. Where the fuck have you been, princess? You can't come here and tell us what to do. And I sat there and I was like, true. T. T. And like, it didn't help that the entire settlement, they were all like, you know, like darker skin. They look brown. And so I'm sitting there looking at this blonde white girl saying, oh my God, help us, help us. Well, she's been sitting pretty with the scions. Like, nah, no. So... You know. <sighs> I'm sapping and I don't even really like Lise. She's cute in the trailer, but that's it. Yeah, she's cute. And she has, she has grown on me now. Like, I like her now. But during Stormblood, it, she just was so weak. I didn't like Lise because she got the person I ship my Warrior of Light with killed. We are not the same. Wait, who do you ship your Warrior of Light with? You still has best bay? True. Mm hmm. At least the great white hope. Oh my god, the great white hope. Don't kill me. Also, let us not forget the ending of Stormblood when we fuck up Shinryu and shit. At least it's like, wow, we did it. I'm so tired. Bitch, did you not see what I just went through? What the fuck? What the fuck did you do, bestie? God. Oh, Papa Limo? Wait, you shipped... Hold on, I'm going full screen for this. You fucking shipped your Warrior of Light with Papa Limo? No, 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 I'm listening. I'm all ears. I want to know. I want to hear it. I'm not judging. I've just never heard this before in my entire life. Papa Limo was a Chad? No, you're so right. <gasps> Hi, Tiffany! Tiffany, how long have you been here? How are you? Every so often, I, I go to your stream and then I remember you're ahead of me and I'm like, ah! <laughs> it's very hard to find good potato chips and Papalima was a very strong moral figure. Kryle is right there! Kryle is right there! What the fuck do you mean? Bro, if like, look, if I, if I didn't get, you know, the whole Lala fell our children thing like glued into my head, I would probably ship Pepper with Kryl. I love her. If you ain't shipping Krataru, what the fuck you doing? Okay, true. You know what? You know what? You got me there. You got me there. Okay, let's get back to the game. Uh, working with friendly factions among the beast tribes, they hope to reopen dialogue and explore new avenues for peace. Given the timing, I suspect they wish to put their uh, respective houses in order ahead of a decisive clash with the Empire. Whatever their intent, this is not a problem easily solved. The Lamincins, in particular, struggle in their efforts, and Alfino and Ishtola have been called upon to aid them. No, please don't make me go to Limsa Lamincin. As long as we are dealing with the Tempered, I'm afraid no amount of dialogue will avail us. Right, okay. But if we can develop a treatment for tempering, then anything is possible. Which is why we must succeed. And on that cheery note, why not make yourselves comfortable in Dawn's respite? I'll show Sidon as soon as he arrives. 
god, I can't wait to see Daddy Sid. Old Saint Sid. I kinda, let me let me talk to these babies for a second. I understand you, you took a little trip to Asisla. Raha made himself useful, I trust. We've made the respite cozier than ever. You're gonna love it. Oh, I'm excited now. What'd they do? Can I have hot chalky in there? When you say cozy, like what do you mean by cozy? Are there lanterns? Is it, oh. Oh, it is cozy! It is kind of cozy. This is kind of kind of snug, I guess. That's okay. It's decent. It'll 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 do. <laughs> this will do. You did you did great, Taru. Daddy, oh, I said what I said. I said what I said. Just you wait. Just you wait for this dilf to walk into the screen. He's coming. Is he coming? Are you coming? <gasps> And it's not voiced. Oh my god, please, please give me a voice cutscene, please. Sid! Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he'd do a run. Oh, he'd do a little gallop. Forgive us for not coming to see you sooner, my friend. As you may have heard, we've had our hands full. In our defense, you are up rather early. I was under the impression you'd be slumbering a while longer. Oh, I would have been, had you not fulfilled your promise. Ha! I still struggle with that idea. From where I stand, the secrets of traversing time and space seem exactly as unfathomable, unfathomable as they ever did. But if an alternate version of myself has already laid them bare, I dare say that frees me up to concentrate on other endeavors. Speaking of which, you wanted my help with something. What is it? Ardbert and Thancred? <laughs> Tiff really said the plainest looking white man, that's what get my engine that's what gets my engine revving. <laughs> Look, okay, listen, Thancred and Ardbert, okay, no, so hear me out. Nah, okay, hold on, hear me out, hear me out. Okay. Look. Thancred went from <laughs> Thancred went from man whore that I would like to tame. To responsible father that I would like to be punished by <laughs> and get head pats from every fucking time Thancred gave Rena head pat and he called her a good girl or like that's my girl or something like bitch what the fuck what the fuck when will it be my turn when will it be my turn please please i just want a little bit of that thing chrissy please and ardbert look i would be simping for ardbert if he did not look exactly like my generic ass bestie one of my besties every fucking game that he plays he makes himself but here's the thing he looks like the default like male option for every RPG ever. Brown hair, blue eyes, basic looking ass. So I cannot sit for Ardbert. I love him, but I ca I cannot because that means I have to sit for my friend. I mean, there's the, I mean no, I sit for Ardbert. Ardbert as a character, moi, chef's kiss. But <laughs> like, does he look so generic? It's true, generic white men, you know. John Final Fantasy? Not John Final Fantasy! <laughs> uh. Fun fact, Sarah, the first time you met Thancred, you asked Chad if this game had a begrudging dad figure who was doing his best but struggles? Or did I actually ask that? Because now look, that dad figure is Thancred. <laughs> Good night, dentist. Take care. Jay, why are you why are you hoeing me? You can't tell me you're not down horrendous. You literally have a tracer booty emote. I know you're down bad. How do I remove these subtitles? Um, if you're on mobile, uh, right above chat, there should be a little icon that says CC. It should be like a little purple icon. You can just tap that and disable it. Aren't we all? <laughs> Do 
down horrendous in this economy? Look, I, I'm always down bad. I'm... I am down bad. But I can admit it. And I respect my... I don't. I can't. I don't respect myself. No. Anyways. Well, well. Treatment for tempering. And for the next step, you need to find the password to this Allegan's report. Oh, wait. Hello. Click. Hello, game. Thank you. Just so, with nary a clue to guide us, we could be here forever and still not guess correctly. And thus, we turn to you. Well, I'd love to say that we could help you, so I will. Once suitably configured, a Magitech terminal should make short work of identifying the password. God, he's so smart. I knew I could rely on you. Now, considering that it might be of use, I took the liberty of borrowing a tombstone from Rambrose. It contains an elegant dictionary. Good thinking. I'll transfer the information to a terminal and set it to work right away. Sick. Don't be down bad, be down glad, nah. Nah. This emote helps me calm down. Why is it? Is it, is it oh, who's this voice? No! Oh my god, the cutscenes are getting so much better that I'm literally getting bamboozled. I used to be able to tell the difference between, like, a voiced cutscene and a non-voiced cutscene, but now it's all blending together. Ah, looks like it's finished. Let's see. Freedom. The password is freedom. Rambrose is my favorite name ever. It's so stupid. Huh, short and simple, just as I said. Would you care to the honors, your highness? I would, my lady. God. He's... Ugh. There's something so cute about calling my male wife your highness. That is my bottom. That is my pillow princess. Node. Open the report entitled Icon Iconic Corruption. An overview. Password. Freedom. Password accepted. Bloop. Opening report. Owen? This report seeks to provide an overview of the mechanism by which icons corrupt and bind men to their will. Owen, those earrings. I love them. The phenomenon we call corruption refers to the alteration of the ether of the soul. Oh? What's going on here? Said ether ordinarily exists in equilibrium. No one element being more prominent than another. Science! But when a subject is exposed to the ether of an icon, this changes, resulting on the properties of the entity in question. Who is that? Do I know- do I, have I seen this one before? By way of an example, exposure to the ether of this fiend, Sephiroth. Oh, it's Sephiroth! Um, I- I think I unlocked the battle for this? I don't know if I did it, though. I know there's a tree that I- a, a Sephiroth tree that I can put in my home. Heaven's Word side quest, we need to do them? I think I unlocked it! I think I unlocked it, or like, I have the quest for it? I remember seeing it somewhere, I don't know. Thanks for reading out loud. I can't bother to read right now. No, of course. I have to read out loud. I have to read the dialogue! Um, sorry. Let me start over. By way of an example, exposure to the ether of the fiend Sephiroth, am I saying that correctly? Would cause the subject's ether to become aligned with the element of Earth. Okay. Ooh! Science! As a consequence, the subject would attain heightened affinity with earth aspected magics. I hate seeing magic spelt with a K, but like, whatever. As well as pre preternatural levels of endurance. Repeated exposure would further enhance these traits, ultimately altering the subject's very flesh. What the? Oh shit. Oh fuck! Hey, hey, it's a little one. The changes undergone by the subject are not solely attributable to elemental alignment. However, further testing, his, further testing has determined that the subject's soul becomes un, umberly, umberly charged or stagnant during the process. 
And this stagnation of the soul has the effect of diluting the sense of self, rendering the subject vulnerable to the will of the icon, the thoughts of whom come to consume their entire existence. In this manner, do the corrupted become worshippers of the icon, their prayers serving to further empower the entity. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! What is with this game and flashbangs? Please! Please, for the love of God! Having discerned the mechanism of iconic corruption, my colleagues and I set out to develop a material capable of shielding one from its effects, an endeavor in which we were successful, albeit at a great cost. In the course of testing, many of my assistants, good men and women all, fell victim to corruption, and in accordance with protocol, they were sum summarily, summarily put to death. You gotta keep you on your toes, literally waking my ass up. I subsequently submitted a proposal to investigate potential cures for corruption, but it was rejected. Deemed non-essential by Lord Ammon. <gasps> Fan of the opera! Though I knew it would be fruitless, I protested the decision. And for my impertinence, I have been stripped of rank and title, and will shortly be expelled from this facility. Damn. In all likelihood, this report will be expunged from the archives. Nonetheless, I record it in the hope that one day someone will undertake someone will undertake to do that which I could not, and find a cure for the victims of the iconic corruption. End recording. Well, that's what Alize and Raha and I are here for. It's not even the elegance were able to find a cure. Or rather, we're not given the chance to do so. One cannot help but wonder what motivated Lord Amon's decision. More importantly, this confirms that stagnation of the soul is indeed the problem, and Angelo can remedy that. Oh my god, her pig! True, yet were we simply to reanimate a tempered soul, I fear it would do not to it would do not to diminish the individual's fanatical faith. Indeed, it may well intensify it. No. We should we would somehow need to suppress the primal's hold over the subject at the same time. Or risk them ever remaining as thrall. If you can make them remember who they were. <gasps> remember. Remember us. So there's no point in reviving their souls unless we can restore their sense of self. No, I'm gonna go with the top one. But of course, memory transference. The process has this effect of compart compartmentalizing memories, separating them into manageable bundles, if you will. By adapting the technique, it may be possible to achieve selective reanimation, that is, limit the effects to only those memories that existed prior to tempering. No, I'm gonna use my other water bottle, it's colder. Through thus restoring the sense of self, we could theoretically drown out the, in the incitements of false faith which had come to dominate the, individual the individual's thoughts. Dominate? Hmm. Hey, Caleb. Remember that we once squelched? Get out. I see. The theory seems sound. And our experience treating the light corrupted would help us to identify suitable memories for reanimation. But are you confident you can adapt memory transference as required? I seem to recall your attempts to do so while trying to bring us home culminated in literal bloodletting. They did. You are right. Despite my best efforts, I could not recreate the mechanism, and I can see that the rather clumsy compromise I reached would not provide the basis for a cure. God, why is Grahatia's neck so fucking thick? Then perhaps it's better that we consider another approach. Your doubts are understandable, but this time I believe we have reason to be confident. You see, nodes such as this were built with the ability to simulate magics. Which leads me to believe that it may be capable of performing simul- Simulations of the transference technique. If so, we would be able to conduct years worth of tests within the space of a few days. Hmm. In theory, it would be no different from how we identify the password. But it'll take more calculating power. A lot more. I honestly couldn't say whether our equipment would be up for the task. Tell me, Sid. Why do you suppose Owen locked his report behind a password? To keep from prying eyes, of course. Why else? the elegans wouldn't have it wait a password that could be guessed by anyone with leisure and a dictionary wouldn't keep it from a person minded to look no <gasps> he wanted his report to be seen by those who strive for freedom <gasps> hence the password not like the members of a certain distinguished engineering collective i believe their motto was freedom through technology or some such 
You two, run up as many Magitech terminals as you can find and bring them to the workshop. Right away, Chief! God, I love the little, like, onion hair style <laughs> that, uh, the Lollapels have. Things are about to get very busy. Lucky we have you to help, eh? I am... I'm excited. I'm nervous. I don't really know... I... I... <laughs> Things are going a little too smoothly. We were able to get the node with ease. Nothing happened to Grahatia when he went to get it. The password was easy to guess. I'm scared. Um, I'm, I'm a little scared, but we ball. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is Final Fantasy XIV. It's um, a massive, it's an MMORPG. And we are pretty deep into it. We're in the, basically like the end bit of the third expansion. So there's the base game and First Xbox, second Xbox, the third one, yeah. So there's a lot. It's okay to be lost. It's fine. It's that's totally okay. I I always get lost. Like I'm I'm the one that's like playing this, and I'm still like, huh? Like what's going on? So don't worry. You're okay. Right. Well, Grazia and I can figure the terminals. I want the rest of you to procure supplies, namely ceruleum to fuel the terminals and ice shards to keep them cool. The more we have of both, the better. Leave the ice shard, leave the ice shards to me. I'll round up some adventures and go on a gathering spree. In that case, I'll just pepper and alize with the ceruleum. Here's a prom uh, promissory note for each of you. Yes! Going on a little trip with my alize, my little baby girl. I love how much this game is like making me work with her. I I bonded so much with alize. I would die for her. I literally, I would risk it all for this little string bean. Take them to the Sky Slow Manif- An Ishgard! <laughs> An Ishgard in the Cerulean Processing Plant in Thanalan. The people there will give you what we need. Yours is the well-known face in the Holy Sea, I believe. If it's all the same to you, I'll head to Thanalan. 25 ah! months poggy woggies. Peter, thank you for 25 month reason. I appreciate it, but much coming to your bad stay. Oh my god! Ah! She's making me go to- Ah! Okay, why am I so excited? I it's the little things in this game that like make me feel good. Like they they subtly mention anything revolving like Heaven's Ward or Ishgar, and I'm like, for me, as a treat. I honestly I haven't been here in like in a, in a hot minute too. I think the last time I was here, it's when. Um, my friend reached Heaven's Ward, and we were here for like five minutes, I think, and that was it. That was it. Okay. Wait, can I like... Yeah, Sky Steel. Sky Steel Manufactory. Is this the new one? No. Final Fantasy is an... It's like an older series. It's been around for a very, 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 very long time. And this is the only one that I've ever played. I've never played another Final Fantasy game. And I'm really enjoying it. I will I would love to try the other ones at some point. Maybe when I finish this. You see in the sky still manufacturing. What is it you require? I require ceruleum. Please and thank you. So you're after ceruleum. In that case, please read the note to our engineer at the airship landing. He shall be glad to assist you. Okay. Where do I go? Eh. This way? The pillars. Okay. Is this like where the ships are? Hello? Yeah, the airship landing. Uh there we go. 10 year anniversary? Seriously? Damn! 10 year anniversary for this game? Because I know Final Fantasy itself has been around for way longer than that. Ceruleum, you come to the right man. Fair warning, though. The price has shot up on account of the uncertainty with the Empire, so I hope you've got the coin. 
Well, actually, I have a note from Sid. Well, no. A promissory note from the ironworks. Don't see many of these. Not that that's a problem. It's as good as gold to me. Please tell me this is voiced. I'm begging, I'm begging. My friend, after the disappointment of not seeing you in Al Amigo, what good fortune to chance upon you here of all places. I feel like I haven't heard Emmerich's voice in so long. As you may have heard, the Allied Nations are making a renewed effort to address the primal problem. To that end, have I invited the chieftain of the Vanu to Ishgard, that we might together plot a course. Wow! Okay! Since the war with the Empire appears to be nearing its conclusion, I would also like to call upon Estinian's lance. Alas, he is, as ever, a difficult man to find. I ship them so hard. I am informed I he recently Estinian paid a visit to the Rising so Stones. Hard. <laughs> Should he happen to do so again, be sure to pass on my regards. Oh, I got you. Don't worry. But tell me, what business brings you to our fair city this day? Well... A cure for tempering. You never cease to amaze me. Until now, our only hope has been prevention. Our every failure irrevocable. But this, this would rewrite the rules of engagement. It could end the cycle of bloodshed. Oh, he's so amped. Very well. You shall have all the ceruleum we can provide and an airship with which to transport it. Thank you. In this matter, you may count on Ishgard's full support. Thank you. I appreciate that so much! That means more to me than you'll ever know! <laughs> Look at Pepper! Oh, my little sh- My sh- My sh- I miss you! Tell Pops I said hello! <laughs> now that's a man! You should have seen Orshafa. Rest in peace, my boy. Do, 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 do. We're getting to work. We're doing the thing. Shit's happening. Got things to do, people to see, places to go. <laughs> oh, what's wrong? Is she taking a nap? Oh. <sighs> Who would have thought Cerulean weighed so much? Oh, puppy. Serves me right for being stubborn, I suppose. I should have just done what you did and accepted help. <laughs> Pepper's really like, yeah, you shoulda. <laughs> Good work, you two. This is all we ask for and more. Quite a lot more now that I look at it. I forgot that's how Sid sounds. Holy shit. Lord Emmerich, eh? And entirely by chance. Ha! <laughs> Some people have all the luck. We have also succeeded in configuring the terminals, thanks in no small part to our able assistant. Shout out to Anthony Bridgerton. 
that Nero? Is that Lise? That's Nero. Why did I it's think it's been a while, <laughs> Hero? You seem surprised to see me. Why Lest did I think that was Lise? Interest in such things as cure. Why did I look at Nero's build and go, "Damn, kind of built like Lise, though." Okay, sorry. Ugh, the divorced husbands. But if you mean to achieve that which eluded even the storied Allegans, it seemed plain that you would require my expertise. <laughs> and so it proved. Is that not right, Garland? Ask Jesse. She was the one who hired you. All I know is you're an employee of the Ironworks now, so you'll bloody well earn your keep. That wasn't the only reason I agreed to cooperate. I'm reliably informed that Garland and I are destined to unravel the secrets of travel not only across dimensions, but through time. Doubtless the lion's share of the credit lies with me. Nine parts to Garland's one. It's giving and this scar research and will be a stepping stone I know he said lions, but like that's not why. It just the tone and everything, you uh, know? Very well then. I'll do a tenth of the work, just the part that's beyond you. <laughs> Whatever you say, Garland. God, this man is By so the way, gay, I love him. The healing applications of Crystal Foci proved very useful in getting us to where we are now. I must remember to thank Mikoto. Mikoto. <gasps> Mikoto! That was the, um, the aura, right? Right. If everyone's ready. Let's begin. <laughs> ah, all appears to be in order. Now, we just have to wait for it to find us our magic. Why not take this opportunity to put your feet up? This may take a while. Can I keep my shoes on? I can feel my eyelashes like, like faltering right now. Oh, we're napping. Oh, we're all literally t the pet pussy. The pet pussy. Do not look at the pet pussy. Why am I wearing a mini skirt? I'm so sorry. Pepper, you whore. Oh shit. I knew Damn it. it. It's overloading. I knew it. I knew something had to go wrong. Chief, she won't last much longer. Neither will I. Uh, we'll have to shut it down. Wait, we're close. So very close. She won't last oh. much longer. She's very close. Been well, there. this is going swimmingly. You're not gonna go help? Please, a moment longer. I beg you. Oh, oh. there. there. <laughs> no. No. I was able to memorize the magic before it faded. It still needs to be put to the proof, but I believe we See, have See, I was cure. literally going to say, like, did anyone get to read it in time? But, like, I was going to say it as a joke. But this fucking dork was like, eh, actually, I got it. Don't worry. I love him. It's just as well. She'll never run again. Fucking Chad indeed. The fault is mine. I'm sorry. Don't be. It may fall short of dimension hopping, but a cure for tempering is not to be sniffed at. <laughs> This, my friend, is a world-changing discovery. One we're proud to have had a hand in. 
A few Magitech terminals are a pittance to pay. Thank you. Well, we've done what we can. The rest is up to you. Oh no, is it Gabu time? Let me forget to pick you up at Lax. Oh my god. Lip bite? What's up? How are you? How are you, Ariel? I will I will come to to LA at some point. I miss y'all. I miss y'all so much. Hello, City Streets. What's up? How are you? The panning Lola Handwave thing is the cutest damn animation in the game, I swear to god. I want it for Pepper. I want it for Pepper so bad. It is very cute. Forget us not. Okay, let's go. Alize has only one thing on her mind. Oh my god. At long last, we have our cure. Oh, in theory, at any rate. Oh, in theory, at any rate. We cannot be certain until such time as we put it to the proof. But I'm quite quietly confident. God, why is OBS fucking freezing again? But when you do, let me know. I w I look. I want to come back so bad. Don't worry. I will. I will come see y'all. Have a good, have a good night, Bean. Love you. Well, if we're to test it on someone, then I suggest Gabu. The symptoms are relatively mild. They'll be fine, I'm sure of it. Yes, as long as we exercise due caution, it'll be fine. That was literally the other voice line. <laughs> or... Dialogue option. Without further ado, then let's make... Without further ado, then, let's make for Limsa. We've kept Gabu waiting long enough. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not ready. I'm not fucking ready for this. Have I tried uh, changing it to Wumbo? I have, and it did nothing. Oh my god, okay. I, I'm, ah, uh, god. Am I gonna cry? Am I gonna, chat, I don't wanna cry again. I can't do this. I can't. I'm scared. I knew this day would come. I didn't think it would come so fast. <laughs> a smile better suits a spoiler. Every time I come here, I always say to LOL, thank you for the CC. You are welcome, Kevin. Man. Put on those booty shorts and shake what your mama gave you. It's booty time. Wow. I love clubbing in this game. <laughs> Oh, I'm scared. I'm so scared. As soon as you cry when you literally see a glass of hot coke. <laughs> I know, I'm so pathetic. I'm so embarrassingly pathetic. Hello? Hello? Oh my god. Look at this fit. Pop off, queen. Oh my god, a dusk white. I almost like never see them. I think that's how it's pronounced, right? Wait, I want to see your adventure plate. Your local chonky cookie loving Hrothgar. <laughs> Amazing. Their name is Chonkerfloof. Kiryu Chonkerfloof. Incredible. I love it when Limsa doesn't load properly because I don't get congested. <gasps> hey, look, it's the guy. It's Ardbert. Nope, my bad. That's just Finn Trip. Okay, where am I going? The aft castle. John Final Fantasy, the one, the only, the John Final Fantasy. It's Meteor. How did they get the the name Meteor? Wonder how Actress R. Jones is doing. Oh my God, we haven't seen him in a very long time. They got the limbs, the hair, the white in the hair. Oh, hello! Well, this is the moment of truth. I'll have our host bring Gabu to us at once. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay. A 
Apologies for the wait. My little dude. Gabu, have you been good? Still no change, I'm afraid. He just stands there in silence until we move him. It's all right now. We're going to help you get better. Mommy! Fancy meeting you here. Mother! Alfredo, you stole her! I thought you were attending to primal matters. No, they're here to watch me cry. We were, and came here for a meeting on the subject. Certain pirate factions did not deign to attend, however, and it was cancelled. We had resigned ourselves to having wasted a journey when we chanced to espy you. Could it be that there has been progress with the treatment? I keep thinking of, like, what happened to Gabu with his family. Using Magitek terminals to formulate the solution. I would never have contemplated such an approach. If this works, or if it doesn't work, so this I will magic, cry regardless. Adapted from memory transference, would be used to purge the subject of their fanatical faith, while Angelo would be responsible for reanimating the ether of their soul. Hmm. Yet I wonder at the practicalities. If one were to reanimate the soul first, it would only serve to exacerbate the tempering. Conversely, a stagnant soul would not respond to the effects of the magic. Mm. Would both need to be performed simultaneously? Ah, nothing escapes Master Matoya's inquiring eye. As you say, both must be carried out simultaneously. And thus, I propose to imbue Angelo with a tempering treatment in much the same manner as I did the spirit vessels. Give me the piggy! Oh, the piggy! Oh, I hate oink oink! Oh my gosh. By doing so, we also spare Graha the trouble of casting spell after spell. It's really rather efficient. Be that as it may, certain difficulties are unavoidable. The imbuing process will still require no small amount of ether. And, as I can no longer draw upon the Crystal Tower's stores of energy, I will be compelled to rely on those of others. So me. <laughs> well, I for one would be glad to assist. As would I. Since the resumption of our duties, it has been naught but stuffy meetings. And I have ample ether to spare. Excellent. With your permission, then, let us begin. Oh my god. Okay, okay. So I'm just gonna stand here and watch and cry? Good. Very good. Preferably a character. Wait, why aren't you a voice actor for a character? Preferably a character like Smeagol? So, Gabu? Yes, I'm Gabu now, do. chat. <laughs> I'm the little baby! Oh my god. And now, it's my turn. God, he's so cool. How the pig is just taking it? She gonna turn into fucking bacon. <sighs> Tis done. <sighs> that gulp? Hold on. No small amount indeed. Okay, oh. well, well? Well, we seek to go where even the Allegans did not. It was never like to be easy. Okay, but is it gonna work? The rest is up to you, Alize. The treatment itself will take time and focus, so we will need a quiet room. 
I'm sure our hosts can spare so one. So you're telling me we didn't just go to the room up front? <laughs> We're just doing this out in the open? Passerbyers can see this? I will go with her. It may be a while before we return. So I would ask I don't get patience. to go there? I don't get to watch? Are you fucking kidding me? I gotta sit here and pray? To a god that I don't even believe in? Okay. You see if we don't. <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay. Twould seem our part is played. Let us find a place to recuperate while we wait for news. Praying in Limso was my favorite album. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now what? Well? Well, it seems as good a spot. It seems as good a spot as any to have a rest. And so they leave me? Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, I don't like the anticipation music. I'm getting antsy. For years, Eorzea has labored to find a solution to the primal problem without success. Any hope that tempering could be reversed faded long ago. Sorry. Why did I say sorry to my mic? Sorry. I myself had given it up as impossible. Given up on the tempered and the light corrupted alike. They were problems to be tolerated or else eliminated, I believed. And to think otherwise was pure naivety. Childishness, even. But Alize refused to give up. She struggled and she struggled. And her efforts were rewarded with a way to bring back Halric. And now countless others may no longer be beyond salvation. I'm so proud of her. However much we bicker, I have the greatest respect for my sister. Had I half her stubbornness, nay, her unwillingness to accept the status quo, I would be a far better person. Oh, Elsie, no. Well, if it's any consolation, she's in awe of your work. Don't tell me. Tell her. Yeah! Yeah! I should, I know. Yet, despite my good intent, I have the feeling that I would only succeed in incurring her ire. <gasps> oh, please tell me she's okay. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, my baby, my baby, my baby, my baby, oh my baby! Alize, are you all right? The treatment, did it work? Oh, I'm so glad to see you all. Delighted, happy, glad. Oh my God! Gaboo! of Great Father Titan. The Great Father Titan? Oh my god! I never forgot about Mother and Father. Always. They were in my heart. Constantly. Ever. Always. <laughs> so I tried to focus on their faces. Theirs and yours. Alize's and everyone's. And I found that I could remember. One thing, then another, and another. Oh! <laughs> Your hopes reached Gabu. They helped him to hold on. My little dude! My little guy! Oh. Oh. I'm so proud of you, <laughs> I couldn't have done it without you, Alize. Can you help the others too? 
kill them, heal them, help them. Can you guy? Yes, we, got we this. can. We got this. Come on, we go help them. everybody. I promise. <sighs> oh my god, he's so happy. <clears throat> Without wishing to dampen the mood, I feel compelled to add certain caveats regarding the viability of the treatment for general use. Oh? What do you mean by that? As you know, reversing the effects of tempering demands a profuse amount of ether. And while Alize was able to heal Gabu alone, I fear the same will not be true for those who exhibit more advanced symptoms. Moreover, the treatment's effects are limited to the soul. It offers no succor to those whose very flesh has been altered through prolonged exposure to a primal's influence. All of which is to say that we cannot save everyone. That's okay. We're doing maybe our we best can't, and or we're maybe trying. we can. No one gave us a hope of saving Gabu and yet here we are. We must find a way to treat as many as possible. Then the next logical step would be to produce a veritable army of porks, is would it not? Granted, it seemed a simple enough process in the first, but I suspect it will be different here in the source. Not that I am any authority, of course. Oh my god. Yet there is an authority on familiars to god whom we may saved. grudgingly turn. She's stubborn, haughty, eccentric, irascible, laconic, annoying. And her name is Master Matoya. Oh my god. The real one. Gilf time. Going back to the gilf. Hell yeah. I have to go now, Gabu. But the people here will look after you, all right? And I promise to come and visit you again soon. Oh. All right. Thank you, Alizé. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Alizé. Alizé, you saved me. I kept thinking of you and, and mum and dad. <laughs> there he go! <laughs> he was all away! He go dump, 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 dump. <laughs> I love him so much. He's so fucking cute. Oh my god. Okay. Alright. Honey croissant lemon waffle? Wait a minute, I kinda want the croissant. I'ma take that. Okay. Uh. Ooh, we got the question mark, question mark, question mark. Like master, like people. The trace of a wry smile is visible on each Thola's lips. This looks like a trial. I feel like I'm about to go unlock something. And she will be at pains to remind me. I have not paid Master Matoya a visit since returning from the first. This seems as good as any. Come, let us make for her cave. Oh, I'll make for her cave, all right. What? No. Fuck, I forgot I have to, like, actually travel all the way there. Hey, Stingray, thank you for lurking. The annoying was so good. Wait, what? You mean, like, the way that she said annoying? I'm sorry, I don't mean to check my phone. I'm, I'm terrible, I'm terrible.
shit. That person that was in chat? Oh my god. Good night, Emmy. That person that was in chat? Fucking. <laughs> the red laugh. <laughs> Sorry. Why am I doing the red laugh to fucking kill me? Holy shit. Nah, the guy who was like, that's UFT, that's UFT, that's UFT. Nah, dude. He's like, FYI, six of her photos are from UFT. Nah! The only one that is like anywhere near UFT is the one that I took beside the museum, which is like the walkway. None of these are at UFT. This guy is insane. Bullied my fucking mod too? Holy shit. Bro! Bro! This fucking guy. Like, of course I'm not gonna dox myself because some of these, like, areas in my photos are neighborhoods! Yo, if you- if you are from Toronto, you would know that Toronto has a lot of old architecture. It is not just U of T! Oh my god! Tell me you're not from Toronto without telling me you're not from Toronto. This best boy from Brampton got into U of T, goes to campus, goes home. Never been to Toronto anywhere else. Like, oh my god, what a fucking weirdo. Holy shit, good riddance. Good riddance. I'ma be blunt. Every single time I've come here, she fights a viewer. Honey. I fight everybody. I'm from Toronto! Of course I fight everybody! So stupid. So dumb. Sorry, I had to- I had to flame it. <laughs> I- Normally I don't like sharing, like, messages like that. I keep it between the mods and I, but nah, that's so funny. This guy was so proud to be so wrong. FYI? Oh my god. Oh my god. Nah. I- I really hate it when people try being, like, too familiar with streamers, do you know what I mean? There was someone, like, there was someone before who did the same thing, and they got so mad at me that they started doxing me. Insanity. They, like, they commented on my profile, and they're like, oh, I love that neighborhood, and, like, listed everything about it, and I was like... Delete, 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 delete. Um... And then, I don't remember what it was that I told them, but I was like, it's something along the lines of like, please don't like comment things like that on my, on my, on my post. And they're like, okay, but this is like a public place. Blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, are you, in, like, are you fucking insane? Like, I know where you are. I know where you've been. Oh my God, that photo that you just took, you, it's at this fucking coordinate. Oh my God, blah, blah, blah. Like, holy shit. Y'all fucking weird. Some of y'all are weird, man. I can say whatever I want on the internet. Oh my god, it's the internet. Ha ha. The world revolves around me. Ha ha. Weirdo. You mean we're not best friends? I'm so sorry. I don't know how to tell you this, bestie. <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this. I don't even remember how to get to Master Matoya. It's like under here, right? Like I have to follow the the bridge. Bessie, more like worsey. <laughs> get out. Get out. You're banned. You're fucking banned. Hello? Oh, I'm I'm, I'm behind a fence. I take it you're ready to bear witness to the joyous reunion of master and pupil? Very well. Yeah, nah, it's- it's fucking wild. I don't have the patience for people, you know? God. Nary a word from you all this time, then you bring every man and his pirogo with you. Did no one teach you any manners, me. girl? <laughs> they were too busy teaching me etherology, master. Jesting aside, I wanted to be the one to express our gratitude. Oh, the lighting here? She I'm looks told amazing. you spared no effort to sustain our bodies while we were away. 
And for that, we owe you our lives. Thank you. <laughs> you were gone so long. I was starting to think you'd set your heart on staying. It wasn't easy to leave, as it happens. Seldom does one have the opportunity to study other worlds, and I would not have minded extending my stay by a handful of years. Ever the scholar. Yestola dedicated herself to studying ancient civilizations of the first, befriending a tribe known as the Knights Blessed in the process. There she took on the name of Matoya and won the respect of all the children of the forest. Oh, is she gonna blush? <laughs> Telling all the tea? <laughs> I merely adopted an alias in accordance with the custom of my hosts. Yours just happened to be the first name that came to mind. Uh-huh. You mean to tell me you went gallivanting about using my name and only bother to visit when you need a favor? And don't pretend you don't. I taught you long enough. Indeed. And devoted pupil that I am, I could not fail to recall my master's sage advice. When the answer eludes you, look to the wisdom of your elders. You there. Were you going to introduce Alice yourself? There? Or Graha? Probably Graha, yeah. How remiss of me. Grahatia is my name, and I am proud to call myself a scion. I too wish to offer my gratitude for your invaluable aid in sustaining the Archon's bodies, as well as my apologies. It was my inexpert summoning spell which endangered their lives in the first place. How did I almost forget that entire plot? Oh, plate? yes. The one bent on digging up the mysteries of Alag. Old Galaf used to speak of you. And Kryles told me all about your recent exploits. Do you have a bad back or something? At ease, boy. Whatever mess you've made, I'm not in the habit of dwelling on the failings of the younger generation. You are... Too kind. I have also heard much and more about you, Master Matoya. Tis an honor to finally make your acquaintance. Well, that's more than enough pleasantries for anyone. Tell me what you want. I haven't got all day. Why do I recognize her voice? Sounds like a character I've heard in like a Ghibli film. Ponto! Sniffer. Do I smell good? So that's the I hope way we had a good stream, Ponto. How are you? It should be a simple enough matter to make the familiar. The magic, on the other hand. Ah, that you may leave to me. Being the only one possessed of royal blood, I alone can imbue the subject with the necessary magic. So I just need to create Porxis with the power to stir the soul. Just, I say. Though we're talking about a veritable herd of the little buggers, we'd collapse before we reached double figures. <laughs> There's so many piggies. But, if I could get a familiar to create oh. the familiars, a mother porksy, Mama as Pig! A mommy piggy! Mwah. Seems I haven't seen the last of that moldy old hole after all.
I just want someone to look at me that way. I just want someone to look at me. <laughs> when? When will someone ever just bend me over, pry me open a bit, and go, Ah! <laughs> Haven't seen the last of that <laughs> of that moldy old hole. Oh my god! You want this moldy old hole? I'm just um, mm -hmm. I'm just saying. It's not old, but it's a little moldy. I'm ready to make blue cheese! No! no! And that was the end of the cutscene, too. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, man. Alright, off to my old workshop, then. Everything required to make your familiar is there. That may be, but no one has set foot in there since the exodus. I just imagine what has become of it. Oh, well, there's sure to be a handful of feral familiars and mayhap a monster or two. I have the trouble the likes of you. You can consider cleaning up the place the place payment for my help. <laughs> Fine, we'll do it. Good girl. <laughs> now if there are no other obja ob objections objections, I just you run along to the maker's quarter. I'll send one of my pierogos ahead to let you into the workshop. You need only tell them who you are. One can't be too careful after all. Off you go. I feel like this is a dungeon. Was I right? Secret Puro Rogo in the Maker's Quarter. Where do I go? Damn, I gotta go far, huh? Good girl, stop. Stop. Chat, you can't just call me a good girl. You can't just do that to me! No! Stop it! You gonna make me- you gonna make me blush! What if I fucked up this frog in Triple Triad? I'm a goob girl. I'm a goob girl. What the fuck? Oh, Calcabrina, right. Now oh, it's my turn? Plus and swap, okay. I'm the goodest girl, true. Fuck! So many sixes. Or eights, rather. I can put you there. Okay, easy. No, not easy. Fuck, I can only- Oh my god. Oh! Sexy! They can take that, though. fucking game. Is that the card I needed? It is! Fuck yeah! Let's go! Easy! First try! First fucking try! Yo, how tall are you again? Taller than you! I am taller than you! That's all that matters, okay? Short stack. Nice dono wall? Hold on. Oh. Shit. Never mind. Never mind. You even you even apologized for not texting back. <laughs> I can't be mean now. Fuck. Well, I'm 5'2. Aren't you like 5'4? At least that's what your license says. Once I put on my boots, I'm as tall as you, if not taller. I think I remember being a little taller than you. Wait, why are you what do you mean Keck W? What's wrong with being 5'2? Our size Jax has an 8-pack? Yeah, look at these guns. Mmm. Okay, where am I going again? Gotta hop on my balloons. You're exposing me? Sucks to suck. Sucks to suck. Sorry, chat. I don't know how to tell you this, but he's not 6'9". And is not 420 pounds. Of, like, 
jack meat. I don't like that. I don't like that sentence, jacked meat. Be sure it's handy at times, remember? How? What is so handy about being short, Ponto? Explain. Share. Share with the class. Jack meat. <laughs> Leave me alone. Don't even? Look, I can stand beside Orshifa again and show you how convenient being short is. <laughs> I don't even have to go on my knees. I can stand up tall. Tall and proud. <laughs> The uppies go crazy! Oh, Red, aren't you like 5'6"? You want uppies too? You want uppies? Bro can't even reach good air quality at 5'2"? You're, you're down breathing in dust with the tiny animals? Holy shit! Ow! You're right, but you don't gotta be so loud! Oh my god! Look, I got asthma and everything! You're kind of spitting! I hate it here! <laughs> Alright, are we here? Yeah. Oh yeah, just, just another day? Just another day doing some squats? Oh, I don't talk to you, Alfie, now. I'm talking to the, the little gooba doobie. Not the hiatusm. Greetings, Ribbit, and welcome to my good mistress's relict. Pluto Rogo is my name, and I'm honored to be your guide. Within, you will find a space dedicated to the making of familiars, along with a cavern wherein the requisite ingredients may be held. I must warn you, however, that the place has not played host to a single soul, much less a broom, in over 15 years, and will, I regret, be in some disarray. But rest assured, my brothers and I shall see to it you don't lose your way. Now then, ribbit, only say the word and I will show you in. Doo! All right. Men wait. Mention her tennis skills? Shut the fuck up! It's not my fault you're so fucking sweaty during Switch Sports, bro! Alright, let's talk about your bowling skills, huh? You can't fucking handle balls for shit! And you have a pair! Don't fucking come in here and insult my sporting skills. God. He's so mean. Have you ever once been nice to me? What? Say something nice about me. Come on, go. You come in here, you ask me about my height, knowing damn well I'm baby, and then you come and shit on my fucking skills? What the hell? Mm -mm. You have a nice dog? True. Thanks. Thank you. You're so right. Dude, he misses you. <laughs> it's so sad. It's so sad. But he'll forget about you, just like I will. In like a couple minutes. Are any of my are any of my my friends here? Wait. I well satisfied you can join me. I love you. I meant to invite Red. <laughs> this is just a dungeon, right? Let's see. Anya's on, but she's in her own world. Let's see. Alright, but... I... I want to tank. I want to tank it. Can I tank it? I'm going to tank it. I want to tank it. I want to tank it. I want to tank it. Oh yeah, Caleb, aren't you 411? I have to renew my sub again over oh, FF. Okay, and I can only assume red is on um Reaper. Oh my god, I forgot about my portrait. Please, please don't give me a mugshot. <laughs> the, the fucking music? Wow, 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 wow. The fucking music. <laughs> Oh 
Right. To begin with, I need you to gather a few ingredients. Listen well to what the Porogos say, or you'll wish you had. Okay. I'm scared. Okay. It's giving duty energy. No! Why is Red the only one with an actual portrait? Me and my fucking mugshot. Alright. Okay. The clay can be had at the clay cot cauldron, Ribbit. Do this portal if you would. Alright. Wait, Syrah, follow me? Wait, what did you want me to sit on? Wait, I'm sorry, I didn't sit on anything. Wait, why are our names slanted? Have, are they always like that? Anyway. Please follow me, Ribbit, and put down any pests that bar the way. <laughs> Oh my god! Great! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Can I- can I keep going? Am I allowed? Is this allowed? I didn't get this little guy, I didn't get this little guy. I got him now, I got him now, I got him now. <laughs> Bro tank, by the way. Thank you! Thank you for the rescue! Oh my god, five head! Wait, I was- I was hitting the wrong button. Oh my god, I'm so used to my other tank abilities. That I, I, can, I fucked up. I fucked up. We're chilling though. We're chilling though. We're chilling. So I have my Gunbreaker AoE swapped. Can you believe it? My Dark Knight muscle memory is out the wazoo. Alright, let's go. Let me to assist you with the gap. Uh -huh. these guys I did not imagine the place would be so infested ribbit it's not that bad ah oh my god son of Ziggy okay I get them all I did What the fuck? Okay, easy! The clay is across the way, but you'll need to deal with the mud man first. The mud man? Look at the mud- Oh my god! What's up, mud man? Look, it's red. <laughs> it is! It is him! Hard rock. Oh. Yo, my HP though? Not a fan of that. Oh, okay. Not gonna send that. Mud bubble? Wait, can I aggro the mud bubble? Do I have to? Do I stay out of it? Oh. What's going on here? What's going on here? Do I stand away? What do I. Do I have to get far away from it? Oh, oh, I see. Interesting. Don't understand the mechanic here. Oh god, 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 oh god. Do I... It's getting bigger! It's getting big! What do I do with the mud bubble? What do I do with the mud bubble? What? Jesus Oh, into the holes! I see. Oh, I see! The holes! I gotta put the balls in the holes! Alright, thank you, Red. Okay. 
Oh, there's a hole behind me. Oh wait, you're taking that one. Um, um, um. Ah! Does it matter? Oh, we can put more balls in the holes. I can, I can fill up a hole. Okay, I'm going to fill up this hole. We're gonna fill this hole. We're gonna fill that hole. Did I get it? No! I missed! I missed the hole! Okay, I'm going here. <laughs> did I get it? I don't know. <laughs> I think I did. Or maybe it ran out. Maybe the hole got, or the ball got too big. All me, easy. Didn't fuck up any of my holes. All right, where do we go? Oh, a little teepee, a little teepee moment. Did we get the clay? Almost killed me like three times. Shut up. Okay, before we go, come here, Sarah. Okay, yeah. Where did you want me to go? You wanted me to sit on something? Over here? Over here? Oh, look at this little guy. Wait, this guy's got a purple hat. Oh my god! The Ishtolo! There's an Ishtola pillow! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! <laughs> Look at it! It's the Ishtola pillow! <laughs> That's so fucking cute! That's so fucking cute! Okay. Alright, the watery portal. Let's go in here. <laughs> It's probably her old bed when she was a little kitten. Yeah. Adrian, thank you for the raid. I hope you had a great stream, my friend. How are you? What's up, friends? My name is Sarah. I'm a Final Fantasy XIV streamer. And we are currently doing 5.4 content. I don't know if any of y'all play, but it's getting it's getting spicy in here. And I'm in, I'm in the middle of a dungeon. And and I am my god. Ah! I hope you had a good stream, friend. Okay, there's someone that I did not aggro. Oh, it's aggro now, okay. I cannot see this angle is really bad. Nice. All right, let's go up here. Bring it down, bring it down. Oh, oh. Ah! Okay, that was, okay, that was supposed to happen. Okay, we're gonna keep going, okay. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a platform for us to like walk across. <laughs> I, was, I was so wrong. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I was already here, thank you very much. I appreciate the rescue, oh shit. No, what are you doing, what are you doing? You come back here. Did I miss one? No. This music is so dramatic. I love it. It's giving uh, like Martin mystery. <laughs> Martin mystery energy. I love it. Ooh. Oh, he's still alive. <laughs> I thought he was dead. Okay, we're chillin'. Whee! And down again, right? Yeah. Oh my god! Okay. Dang, you're pretty as fuck, shorty gang gang. Thank you. Thank you. You're asking me into tank spot and you get- and you get insured? True! True! Sorry, healer. You're gonna be the tank now. Look, it's me when Graha. Creamy? A little cream puff? 
Oh my god, I fucked up. I didn't realize I had that up. Okay, what does this do? What are these crystals? What is happening here? Oh my god! Do they have to just like not be in my my line? Okay. So I guess don't stand there when those go off. Yeah. Hello? <laughs> my ability! More water? We mean we need more water? Oh. 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 Are we supposed to stand in there? Ah! Oh. I guess we're supposed to go up there. Oh, that's a oh! <laughs> that's a lot of water. Oh, okay. Let's get out. Why will you get hit? Hey, I don't know what the timing for this is. Interesting. I'm just gonna leave him here. Because it's at a wall. Okay. So don't stand in those lines. Yeah. Okay. Oh! It's dead! <laughs> it's so cute, I feel really bad! <laughs> Right, let's go on to the last one now. Fire, kiln fire. Interesting. This dungeon's fun. It's very interesting. Mm. Step right through ribbit and I'll guide you safely to the kiln fire and cauldron. Nice to see you. Lava so bad. Lava so bad. Oh god. Oh god. What the heck? Uh, can I run through it? I don't know when that's gonna go off. Okay. Oh, I fucking clicked the wrong one. Oh my god, controllers, am I right? Hey, look at this, guys! He's a vovey! The flan isn't on me, there we go. I just didn't think of magic rooms walking about. <laughs> it's so Disney. It's so fucking cute. God, this looks like paint. It's like a big oil spill. Go this way. Go this way. This way, yeah. I see the portal. Over. Poro that's what they're called, right? Poro Rogo? Oh no, this one's Buro Rogo. My bad. Syrup, slime, marshmallow. I do love like the Poro Rogos are just there watching us fight and not helping. I mean, I guess they are helping by like clearing paths and stuff. I mean, this was our job. They did say that we would have to do this. We'd have to do the hard work. Do the dusting, if you will. I'm mommy? Did you just call me mommy? Me? Mommy? Thank you. So kind.
Parting the sea? Jesus could never? Or it's Moses, right? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I definitely wasted that ability, but you know what? That's fine. like a minute and a half until I can use it again. That's okay, I guess. What a fiery battle that was. I don't mean the magma. Alright. Last boss? I think, yeah. Mother Porksy. Oh no! Mommy Piggy! Where Piggy? Where Where the Piggy? Where the... Oh! That takes care of the kill and Ribbit. Do you go to here? Oh, that's so cute. It's like a huge, like, cauldron. I love it. We're baking a pig. But they want us to defeat the mother. Is it gonna go wrong? Oh, no. Right then. Let's get this over with. What's up? Oh! <laughs> Newborns are wont to be difficult. <laughs> sure, who's in charge? Oh my god, you want us to- This is animal abuse. Mother Matoya's animal abuse. Look at her, she's so cute. Oh my god! She got your crown! Unraveled quickly for the prime sub, I appreciate it. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Right. Do I just go straight down then, I guess? Yeah, I see the stairs over there. Mapping the realm. Matoya's relic. Interesting, interesting, very interesting. I'm gonna pull you back over here. Come on, come on. Oh, mmm. <laughs> I let go of my thumbstick. And I don't have a plunge. That's fine, I guess. Can I keep going? Oh, what is that? Take care you don't get sucked in. I don't wanna get sucked. This is not how I wanted to get sucked. Oh shit, oh god, oh god. Hehe, <laughs> it looks. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Ah! 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 <laughs> no! No! I got sucked! Am I okay? Am I okay here? Oh! Oh! To a crisp! Did she give me that good gunk gunk? Oh my god! Mommy! Not like this! Uh, where's North? Ah, uh, fucking whatever. Are you fucking kidding? I'm not sure I pressed the wrong button. That's fine. No, we're chilling. We're good. Get out so you go into the hole. Okay, yeah. Fuck that up again. That's fine though.
damn piggy. How did I use that? Tenderloin. <laughs> That's what that's called? Tenderloin? <laughs> Where are you going, Bucky? Oh, okay. Easy. Easy. Oh my gosh, she did! She did the poor piggy! The poor piggy! Why am I so happy? You just hurt the piggy! Look at her! Oh, she's so cute! Oh, she's so cute! I just wanted to discover her! So she's about to birth a bunch of other pork seeds? Sorry, I love too. Hey man, thank you so much for the two months reason. I appreciate it. I'm about to come to your bedrooms and your stay. Thank you. A new recruit has arrived? Oh my god, I forgot about that shit. Oh my god, look at her! <laughs> look at her! Look at her! She's so cute! She's so cute! I wanna just, I wanna just, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna just, I wanna, I give pets. I give little pets. She's so cute. Look at her eyelashes! She looks like me right now. I'm her makeup artist, if you didn't know. Alright, let me get out of here. That was fun. I like that dungeon. That was really cute. Oh my fucking gosh, you fucking did. <laughs> Look at her! She got your crown! <laughs> there we are. Quite tame. Then all that remains is for me to imbue her with the magic. My friends, I'm afraid I must trouble you for your ether once more. Oh, I'm so, why am I scared of this? Is it gonna like exhaust them? Am I gonna have to carry them on my shoulders? Oh no, we got the hype man music, we're good. We're chillin'. I don't know why, but hearing this theme makes me so emotional because I just remember like everything that happened in the Crystarium. It just makes me- it, rem it reminds me of 5.3 and the end of 5.0. Oh, here we go! Look at her little snorful! Oh. You're okay. You're fine. Ah, that should suffice. Good. Let's set her to work then, shall we? I want to see some porks. I like the pixels on the wall. Assuming that is someone that can spare the requisite energy. Little FF pixels. A mere drop in the ocean for the great sorceress Matoya, I dare say. That counts as a flashbang shot. Oh, you're tired too, girl. Oh, are you gonna puke? She's normal! Oh! She make a baby! Oh, she make your baby! Oh, she make your boo-boos! She got your boo-boos! Excellent. Our very own litter of Angelos. <laughs> your baby Angelos! And we can make as many more as we want, simply by providing the mother Porksy with additional ether. Oh, that's gonna be so bad for us, though, don't you think? <sighs> I will require a moment before... I try again. I'm listening. It's still hard work, 
but a damn sight more efficient than making them one by one. Thank you, Master Matoya. Everyone, we're a step closer to our goal. Distributed amongst the Allied Nations, they should do much to facilitate closer dialogue with the Beast Tribes. And given their present travails, I believe our friends in Limsa Laminsa should be the first beneficiaries. Agreed. Though I must leave this errand to you. I doubt my legs will carry me out of the cave, much less to Vilbrand. It's a shame we don't have a Hrothgar to carry you. Thank you for taking the lead in gathering the ingredients. I expect you would benefit from a rest too. I am a sleepy girl. You're so right. In addition to the porkses, I trust you've gained an inkling of how much effort goes into the creation of familiars. Or mayhap you attribute your struggles to old age. If I said yes, would it persuade you to treat me like an adult? No. <laughs> Not with that pertness, it wouldn't. <laughs> anyway, assuming you have no other favors to ask, I shall be leaving. I forgot. I don't know where I left it, but I have a code to get Master Matoya's hat in the game. Scott, would you want it? I have the code somewhere. I just, I don't know if it's still in my book or not. Lest you wonder, Master Matoya has returned to her cave with Ishtola. Hmm. <laughs> there is peas in a pot, are they not? Oh, I forgot to switch off with Dark Knight. Look. We now enter Matoya's relic. Yay! Um. Yeah, we'll go back to Reaper. It's the only one high enough. Ooh. Oh, girl, no. I'm glad I have better gear. But. I look so dumb. Alfino is eager to deliver the good tidings to Limsa Lamensa. Well then, my friends, let's return to Limsa Lamensa and deliver the news to the Admiral. <gasps> Merle A word to the officer in Bulwark, Bulwark Hall. Bulwark Hall should be sufficient to secure us an audience. Perfect. So I can go there and then change. If I could wear it, sucks to suck. I do hate that, like, the Hrothgar and Viera can't wear hats. Like, I wish they would just, like, alter some of them or, like, make them, like, clippable so the ears could poke out or something, you know? Yeah, Hrothgar can't wear hats. It sucks. It's a crime against Kelsey. It is discrimination. Racism! Damn it, Yoshi P. Every day I find something new to complain about. Let Kelsey wear hats! Okay. I guess I could just do it like this. Yo, why is my game lagging? Hello? I'm gonna put on this one. What is fucking going on? Game? Do y'all see this? Oh, is it because I haven't fully loaded into Limsa yet? Oh, wait. Hello? I'm chilling now. Okay. All right, game. Thanks, game. Oh my god. They have the gin yummy tomato hair. They have the gin yummy tomato hair. Look! Oh my god. They don't have the gin yummy to Oh, oh my god, he's looking at me. Oh, um um I know, it's the same shade and everything. Oh, I get a bow? Oh my god? They're just as sweet as the other yummy tomato man? I get- do I get kissed back? I guess not. I guess not. Not even- not even a little blows kiss. Oh, 
walk up and tell welcome hello 25 male oh they rp bro they fucking rp they got a card and everything don't mind if i do <laughs> Adventure plate that I collect cat boys, huh? Don't simp or he'll die! <laughs> You're so right. Collecting cat boys all across Eorzea. Two for good measure? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so spoiled tonight. Thank you. You know what? Fuck it. I'm adding it to my adventure plate. Hold on. What is the search comment? Head pats and cat boy <laughs> collector. Would you like ear wiggles as well? Absolutely. Absolutely. Am I gonna get the little? Am I gonna get ear wiggles? <laughs> Another cat boy? Another kiss? For me? Another- <laughs> More cat boys? For me? I've seen this video. I've seen this video somewhere. On my way as a Hrothgar, it counts? <laughs> I'm here! I'm here! Give me my kissies! Give me my kissies! Where's Putty Putty? Where's Putty Putty? Also, you didn't give me a kiss yet! Where's my kiss? Yes! Yes! There we go! There we go! Oh wait, they're gone! They're gone! Well, at least I have you. What do the kisses do? They make me feel loved. It's literally just an emote. That's all. So spooky dotes upon you. Oh! I got a I got a kiss from a bunny girl. Mommy, come back! It's on brand. If cat boys can be there, cat men should be able to be there too. All right, I have to go. I have to go. I can't do this anymore. I can't flirt. I can't do this anymore. I have to go. I have a mission. I have a mission. Oh, wait, Avalon. Hi, babes. There, Avalon. I'll give you a kiss too. Oh, <laughs> oh, you finally got dote. Wait, hold on. There we go. I don't know if it's gonna. No, I gotta redo it. <laughs> add the cat boy. You want me to add the cat boy? All right, bet. Now will he ex- ah I'm in! I'm in! I'm in! Let's fucking go! Oh, and I got the cat- I got the cat ear wiggles again! I got the cat ear wiggles again! Oh. You're gonna- Oh, there you go. Oh my god, your umbrella! It's a cactor umbrella! That's so cute! Okay. All right, I must go. I'm on a mission. I have things to do. 
Hi, besties. Even as we speak, we are weaving a new future. And when it all becomes history, I hope that those who follow may look back with gladness. Some bad shit's gonna happen. Oh shit, I don't remember what that said. Let me see. But Pepper, ever a welcome sight. I'll tell you this for the Admiral, you say? She's presently receiving guests, but for the Scions, and I know well- I know! But for the Scions, I know she will make an exception. Uh, follow me. Look at me and my cat, boys. Merle Wave, you are looking magnificent tonight. My friends, what brings you here this day? Is this true? By the navigator, a cure for tempering. As often as I've been in awe of you, Scions, I would not have thought it possible. Merlewib is what I what I envision Femme Hrothgar is to look like. You know? She just has that energy. I know she's a row, but like, something about her. And yet it is, Admiral. We've done it. Here in Limsa, and production of more familiars has already begun. You, you have my thanks, truly. This will do much to advance the cause of peace, yet I fear it will take more to close the rift twixt man and beastman. She's the baddest bitch? You're so right. I know! Literally, I'm like, I'm so mad that the difference between mask and femme in this game is so, 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 so different. Like the male aura versus the female aura. Why can't I have a beefy little dragon girl? It, it it doesn't make sense. I do love that like the female Viera are incredibly tall and the male are incredibly small. Like I do love that. But like, yeah, I want buff lion women. I want the row, like even the fem rows. They're not dazed enough, you know? I don't know. Bah, even to speak thus divides us. Welcome as it is. A cure will not guarantee reconciliation between our peoples. For those summoning and the tempered may serve to fuel the conflict, they are but symptoms of it. If we are to resolve the primal problem once and for all, we must uh, we must adjust the cause. We must strive for mutual understanding and find a way to leave our bloody past behind. It was I who moved that the alliance renew its push for peace. Since our ancestors came to the, these shores some seven centuries past, we Lamincens have been at odds with those who share our island home. Save for a brief moment of cooperation with the kobolds, our history has been one of nigh constant territorial squabbling. <laughs> Meanwhile, the struggle with the Sahagin for control of the seas has only grown fiercer. Or Sahagin, right? A matter made worse by a thrice damned calamity driving them to seek new spawning grounds. God, that character design is amazing. For survival at stake, he each had no choice but to fight, and so I dismissed peace as impossible. Impossible is a word coined by the weak, I proclaimed to all who'd listen, and then gave up. You and yours put me to shame. Since you led us to victory against the Black Wolf, you have achieved the impossible again and again and again. Careful. And I thought it and I thought it high time that I followed suit, hence my proposal to the Alliance Council. But no sooner did I reach out to our neighbors in Vilbrand than my own people sought to thwart me. You speak of the pirates who failed to attend the meeting. Oh yeah, they mentioned that. Aye, acting through a friendly faction among the kobolds, we had intended to seek an audience with a prominent uh, patriarch. But the bloody executioners would not hear of it, and their absence sent a message to the rest. Though they are but one of the three pirate powers, they are the greatest, and any attempt at peace would found with, with founder without them? Would founder without them? Or flounder? I don't know. I'm given to understand that their leader, Captain Hilfir, Hilfer, has been bedridden for some for some while with an ailment of the lungs. Oh no! Pneumonia? Correct. In his absence, his right hand leads a man named Sickard, but recently risen to prominence again among them among their marks. 
Marks, ranks, whatever the hell she said. Save for his disdain of authority, for authority, little is known about him. We have invited him to speak with us more than once, but he will not come. I've tasked the little jackets and the rogues with uncovering his motives, but they have learned not of any value. <sighs> we have a nose for the truth. Whatever this sickard wants, we'll find out. Or sickard, I guess. Truly, I'd be much obliged. I shall look forward to hearing what you learn then. Good luck. Alrighty then. Okay. I... I'm going to take a little... A little break. Just for a second. I... My head is really hurting, so I'm gonna, like, take off my headset and stuff and just kind of, like, sit back for a little bit and hope that it eases up. Um... And so, give me like a couple minutes and then I'll decide if I want to continue or if I want to hop off for the night. We'll see. Uh, so I'll be back in uh, at like 1.15, I want to say. Bye-bye! Wait a second, I'm just going to put you all... Uh, with with this here, I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. We'll we'll do this. We'll do this. There. There you go. How's that? Is that better? Do we like this? Yeah. Okay. <laughs>
Okay, chat. So, like, the headache isn't really going away. Unfortunately. I mean, like, it's not like it's going to go away that fast. Um, but I am ouching quite a bit. Um, you know when, like, the headache starts getting closer towards your eyeballs? You know that energy? That's kind of like where I'm at right now with it. Yeah, it's inching into a migraine. Exactly. It's not quite there yet. I think it's definitely time for sleep. Yeah, hold on. I'm checking. Mm. Yeah. So it's like, it's not at the stage, it's, it's not at a stage where I'm like, oh, my head hurts, like, like, oh, I can't function, but it's getting there. You know, before I was like, oh, I could tolerate this, this isn't too bad, but because it's like getting closer to my eyeballs, that's, yeah. So, I think this is where we're going to call it. I had a lot of fun. I fucking love playing this game. I love this game so much. It's just so fucking good. Early warning signs? Exactly. Exactly. Once you start feeling the pressure like in your eye like behind your eyeballs, that's when you know to to take it back. Oh yeah, migraines are so bad. I fucking hate migraines. I get them pretty frequently. And yeah. I get the nauseous feeling too, Kelsey. It's it's not fun. But, yeah. I will not be live tomorrow. Um, or I will be at, like, midnight. I'm going to the symphony again. Uh, with my friend. So that's gonna be fun. And then she leaves, I believe, Sunday night. Or Sunday afternoon. So I'm... No, Sunday's my day off. So I'll be live on Monday. So I won't see you all until Monday. But come Monday, we will go through some more MSQ. Or maybe we'll just do some dailies. Or whatever the heck. I don't know. We'll see. I hope you all had a great day and had fun. I certainly had fun. Um, but I, I do need to go lay down now. So I will see you all in the Discord server. And on other socials. So don't forget to follow me on social media. And what happy that we can stay up to date with all my shenanigans and get notified for when I go live. We're gonna go raid. Who are we gonna raid? We're gonna go raid. We're gonna raid. We're gonna raid. We're gonna raid. Is Todd still on? Is Todd hopping off? I don't know if Todd is hopping off. I don't think Todd is hopping off. We're gonna go raid Todd. We're gonna raid Shadow Legends. You're banned. All right, let's go say hi to Todd. Let's. Let, should we drop some Syra Uwus in the chat? What do we? What do we spam? What are we? I want to work on a new raid message. I've been trying to, to think of one, but I can't. Is it gonna be the Syra Uwus? I don't know. Is my is my raid thing even going? Can you see it, chat? Did that work? I typed it, but I don't see it. Okay, I see it on the on the thingy, Majiggy. I showed you my moldy hole. No, just the Syra Uwus. We'll just do the Syra Uwus, okay? Bye, friends. I'll see you on Monday. Good night. <laughs> Kelsey. <laughs> <laughs>